what's up with a happy Roblox family. day of school. But I don't mind it so much today because we're having pizza for lunch. Pizza for lunch. Having pizza for lunch. Um, Molly, are you seriously doing a pizza dance right now? Well, um, yes, I am doing a pizza dance. We're having pizza for lunch. <laughs> Brookie, <laughs> aren't you excited about pizza for lunch? I'm more excited about the school dance this weekend. It's gonna be amazing. Oh yeah, the school dance. I kind of totally forgot about that. Forgot about the school dance? Really, it's the event of the season. Yeah, but I was more dreaming about pizza. Pizza. Molly, snap out of it. There's more important things in life but food. Okay, yeah, maybe some food, but there's nothing more important than pizza. <laughs> Um, yeah, Molly, what about your homework? Um, no. That is definitely not more important than pizza. Hey, look, there's Luke. Uh, hi, Luke. Oh, hey, Brookie. Hi, Luke, I'm here too. Uh, hi, Brookie. No, I'm Molly, remember? Oh, yeah, sorry, Molly. <laughs> um, hi, Molly. Hi, uh, how are you doing today, Luke? I'm good. Hey, um, Molly, could I talk to Brookie for a minute? Oh, yeah, I'm I'm done talking about pizza, so, yeah, you can talk to her. Um, no, Molly. I mean, like, alone. Wait, what? We're all friends. I'm sure whatever you can say to Brookie, you can say in front of me. Did you have bean burritos for breakfast? Do you need to, um, you know, fart? What? No, Molly, no. But I do need to talk to Brookie, like, alone. Um, Molly, maybe you should go into class. We'll be there in a minute. But, 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 but... Molly, seriously. Okay, fine. Maybe they're planning for my birthday party. <laughs> That's probably definitely what they're gonna do. I'm just gonna hide behind this tree and spy on them and see what they're talking about. <laughs> Look, you can't even see me. I'm totally invisible. <gasps> so, um, Luke, what did you want to talk to me about? <laughs> Um, well, um, so, um, the, uh, uh... Uh, do you have anything to say besides us? Uh? <gasps> well, I, I was wondering, how's your day going and, and stuff? Oh, <laughs> um, well, it just started because it's morning, but so far it's going pretty good. Except for the fact that I burned my bagel in the toaster oven. Ugh, that was so annoying. But then I just spread extra cream cheese on it with some strawberries and you can hardly taste that it was burned. I can totally make, you know, lemonade out of lemons. I like lemonade. <laughs> wait, wait, what? What do you mean you can take lemons and make them lemonade? Oh, I just mean when something bad happens, um, like you buy lemons instead of oranges at the grocery store, then you can basically, um, well, make lemonade. You know, see, even though it was a mistake. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. <laughs> I sort of get it. Anyway, I have a question to ask you and, well, um, uh, uh. Like guacamole, what's a cat got his tongue? Yeah. Spit it out, Luke. Tell her what you're buying me for my birthday. Luke, it's okay. You can just ask me what you want to ask me. Do you need help with your math homework or something? No, um, although you are smarter than me in math class, uh, I was wondering, do you want to go to the school dance with me? Wait. <gasps> Wait, what? Wait, what? We asked Brookie to the school dance? That can't be right. Luke, Luke likes me. I I don't understand. Uh -oh. oh, um, I thought you'd ask someone else to the school dance, like maybe Molly or something, since you guys are such good friends. No, Brookie, I'm asking you because I like you and I think we'd have fun at the school dance together. Oh, okay, well, um, I 
likes Brookie? Even when he was asked if he liked me, he picked Brookie? Well, Brookie's my BFF. She'd never say yes. Right? You know what, Luke? Um, I'd love to go with you. Sure, yes. Great. <laughs> I'll pick you up about 7 o'clock. Sounds great. See you then, Luke. Bye. Ah! My gosh. I just got a date to the school dance. <gasps> oh, hey, Molly. <laughs> um, did you have to go to the bathroom or something? Why aren't you in class? <clears throat> wow. You're growling at me, Molly. Okay, that's a new thing. Do you want to go into class together? Molly, where are you going? <coughs> Molly! If he wants Brookie, then Brookie is what he'll get. Ugh, today was the worst day of my life. Ugh. Daisy. Oh, hey, Molly, what's up? Just working on some homework. Daisy, I have to ask you something. Uh, okay, what is it, Molly? Whoa, you look really grumpy. Daisy, will you give me a makeover? Wait, what? Did I just hear you wait, Molly? Could you say that again? I'm not sure I heard you. Daisy, will you give me a makeover? I have been waiting for this day for my entire life. Okay, okay, don't get too excited about it. Molly, we could not do the makeover here. Really, why not? Because I don't have the supplies I need, and this is going to take a lot of work. Ah, <sighs> fine. Where are we going? Bookhaven Salon, of course. And don't worry, Molly. You are going to be so amazing when I'm done. <laughs> I'm so excited. Ugh, again, I say, worst day of my life. Molly, you turn that frown upside down. You're about to get a luxurious makeover. I don't know any girl in Bookhaven who wouldn't want that. Me, I wouldn't want that. Molly, at least try to smile. Ha, ha, how's this? Uh, yeah, we're gonna have a lot of work to do here. Oh, hey, Daisy. Back for a makeover so soon? No, remember I told you I had the sister who was a total well... <sighs> I don't. Um, okay, yeah. Why did you bring in this homeless person off the street? No, that's my sister, the one I was telling you about. She's decided she wants a makeover. Bring out the entire staff. We need the whole crew on this one. It's going to be epic. Oh, again. Worst day ever. Oh, don't say that. Once you have our makeover, you're never going to want to do any other makeover ever. You're right. I probably won't. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that water too cold, honey? No, I just really have to light a bean burrito. Uh -oh. What? Is the water too cold? No, I just really have to fart. And I didn't think it was polite in a salon where everybody's pretty and perfect and... Oh, no, dear. We all eat bean burritos. It's okay. Okay, great. <laughs> Molly! Sorry. She's got me in this crazy position and it was putting pressure on my stomach and... <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Well, at least she'll look good, even if she doesn't smell it. <laughs> okay, let's dry your hair. And what color were you thinking you wanted your hair to be? Um, I was thinking like brown. Can you do brown? Uh, yeah, sure. But your hair is blonde. Don't you want to do something with your hair color? Yeah, Molly, why don't you want to look like you? Actually, I was thinking that I could look exactly like Brookie. Uh -oh. Wait, what? You want, a Brook you want a Brookhaven salon makeover to look like your best friend? Why, Molly? Because I just do, okay? Now make me look like Brookie. Well, I'm not paying any tip. Whoa. We'll do whatever you want. Just give us a tip, okay? Molly, what are you thinking? You want to look like you, don't you? You're, you're beautiful in your own way. Especially with a makeover. No, I want to look like Brookie. <sighs> okay, Molly. Whatever you say. A few minutes later. Wow, you look <gasps> fabulous. Yes, but do I look like Brookie? Well, this is the exact hair color and haircut we give to her. But now we need to do something with your makeup. Well, give me Brookie's face, please. Well, your face is your face, but we can definitely give you something pretty similar. Perfect. Hot dog! I look just like her! Molly, I don't know. Why don't you want to look at yourself again? Because I want to look like this. Now, 
What would Brookie wear? Something with a dog on it or an animal or something. <laughs> I look amazing. Uh, Molly, you look just like Brookie. That's kind of weird and creepy. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Are you guys trying to do a twinsy thing at school tomorrow or whatever? I mean, this isn't what I had in mind for a makeover. Well, you got what you got, and this is what you got. Hello? Uh, hey, Molly, it's Brookie. Look, I was just wondering if we're okay. What do you mean, you wonder if we're okay? I'm fine. Okay, well, um, I have a dentist appointment tomorrow, and I have to have one of my wisdom teeth pulled out, so I'm not going to be at school. Uh-oh! Oh, perfect! Perfect that I'm having a tooth taken out? Molly? No, 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 I meant... Perfect that you get to see the dentist because they always give you a lollipop afterwards. So you won't be at school tomorrow at all? No, I I won't be at school until the dance um, tomorrow night. Okay, well, good luck. Bye. Molly, what was that all about? Oh, nothing. Come on, let's go home. Hey, what about that tip? Oh, yeah, almost forgot. Okay, your total is $375. Holy guacamole. Looking like Brookie's expensive. Brookie! Brookie, over here! <laughs> it worked perfectly. Oh! <clears throat> oh! Hi! Brookie, your voice sounds just a little different. I don't... I mean... Uh, <clears throat> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, never mind. I guess maybe you just have a little cold or something. So, um, still gonna pick you up tonight at 7? Yeah, absolutely. Um, pick me up at Molly's house. Yeah, because I'm going to get ready there for the dance so I can look pretty for you and all that stuff. Okay, well, I'll see you then. I can't wait for the dance. M me either. <clears throat> me either. <clears throat> me either. Molly, are you going to the dance? Yeah, of course I am. It's going to be so much fun. But you're not going as yourself, Molly. You're going as Brookie. Are you guys seriously pulling a prank on us or something? Yes, something like that. Um, see you later. I've got to go. Perfect timing, Brookie. Get in. This dance is going to be so much fun. I know, right? I can't wait to go. <laughs> wow, that almost sounded like Molly when you were laughing. You guys must be spending so much time together that you even laugh alike now. <clears throat> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I can't wait to go to this dance with you, Luke. It's going to be so much fun. I couldn't agree more, Brookie. I really like you. Aww. Why doesn't he like me as Molly is the better question. Wait, what did you say? Oh, nothing. <laughs> I'm just so glad to be here with you. I like your cute little shirt. It's adorable. <laughs> Thanks. Where's Luke? He totally stood me up. Was this some sort of joke that he wanted to go to the school dance with me? I'm all dressed up. He was supposed to meet me at 7 p.m. And it's after 9. Uh-oh. <sighs> well, I guess I'm going to the dance by myself then. How rude. Come on, Luke. Don't you want to dance? Um, yeah. I think I will. Awesome. Are you afraid to dance? I mean, some boys are not very good at dancing, so they get nervous. What? No, I'm good at dancing. Oh, yeah? Prove it. Okay, I'll show you my dance moves. Don't get too jealous. <laughs> I don't plan on getting too jealous because I've got dance moves of my own. I can't believe Luke stood me up. Well, I'm still going to have fun at this dance. Wait, what? Is that my twin? Wait a minute. That looks just like me, but is that Molly? Uh-oh. <gasps> Molly! Uh-oh. Are you at the school dance dressed like me? Wait, what? What's going on? Brookie? Brookie? There's two Brookies? Two Brookies? I don't see two Brookies. Where's two Brookies? Molly, knock it off. <laughs> I thought I asked one to the dance and then this one's here and I don't know which Brookie is which. I'm the real Brookie. That's Molly. No, it's not. Uh-oh. Molly, you just talked in your voice. Why would you do that? You just stole my boyfriend. Well, first of all, he's not your boyfriend. And if he's anybody's boyfriend, he's my boyfriend. What? He didn't agree to be your boyfriend, did you? Well, the, I'm not here for any girl fights. I'm out of here. What? You can't leave the dance. You invited me here. Um, nope, I'm out. See ya. <coughs> I wanted to get a pizza anyway. 
Can I jump out the window? Okay, no. I'll just go out this way. Look, you made my date leave. Your date? Looks like he was having a good time with me, actually. Molly, I can't believe you'd do this. Why would you? I can't believe my BFF would steal my boyfriend. <gasps> he wasn't your boyfriend, Molly. He was fair game, and he asked me to the dance. I don't want to be your best friend anymore. You knew I liked Luke, and you went to the dance with him anyway. I don't want to be your best friend either. I guess we're breaking up. <laughs> well, I guess we are. Who needs her anyway? It's not like we did everything together. It's not like we had all the sleepovers and pizza parties and birthdays and... Oh, no. What have I done? La, 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 la. Mmm, this dinner smells delicious, doesn't it, baby Kira? Oh, sweetheart, is that cold getting you down? I don't like being sick. Well, this delicious and nutritious dinner should make you feel so much better. I want you to hold me. Oh, honey, I can't hold you right now. I'm I'm trying to make dinner. I just don't want you to die. Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. Ba ba ba. Yes, Daisy. I'm a little busy making dinner and dealing with the fact your sister is sick. Well, you want to know this. Molly is driving me crazy. She even tried to pull my pigtails and she said that I was being a tooth. What? What did she say? A tooth. Oh, my goodness. Daisy, you tattletale. You always have to tell Mom everything that happens between us. And, 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 and I just, ugh. Come here, Daisy. Girls, stop, stop this right now. Get back here, Daisy. I'm, I'm going to get you, Daisy. And what I do, girls. Oh, my gosh. I can't even right now. I'm, I'm definitely going to need to call some help. I wonder if the babysitter's available. Girl, girls. I don't think so, Molly. You stay away from me. You put my pigtails and call me names. Ugh, I have a good mind to ground you both. But I didn't do anything. I didn't get your body, did you? Huh, I just need a break for a minute. Oh. Hi, Maggie's babysitting service. What can I do for you? Oh, hey, Molly. Maggie, it's Mrs. Acker. And, well, uh, I'm just having, like, the worst day ever. I have so much work to do for my job. My daughter, my littlest daughter is sick. I'm trying to make dinner. My oldest daughters are fighting. My husband's away for a work training. And I could just really use you for a couple of hours. Can you come in? <gasps> what? I can barely hear you. Sorry, I'm on a Jamaica vacation right now. Uh -oh. And, um... I'm nowhere near Brookhaven. Oh, okay, thanks anyway, Maggie. Bye. Uh, maybe Susie's available. All right, let's try this one. Yo, what's up? It's Susie. I'm not going to be home for a week because I'm on vacation. What? Is everybody taking a vacation in January? Doesn't anybody work anymore? Oh, well, this leaves me no choice but to call their grandma my mother-in-law is well sort of a karen even though her name isn't really karen but anyway ah, she's the only one that'll be available hello oh hi it's your daughter-in-law and i could really use some help why you can't manage your own children well, I mean, yeah, I can, but I'm trying to make dinner, and I have work, and um, baby Kira's got a cold, and the older girls are fighting, and could you come over for a couple of hours? Oh, I see. So your children are extra naughty. I'll handle that. Hello? Um, are you coming over? Hello? This is war, Molly. Oh, yeah? Well, guess what I'm doing? I don't know, but you're not going to win. I don't want you. I have a good win. Holy guacamole. What are you two girls doing? Put those things down right now. Your grandmother's on her way. You mean your mom? No, your dad's mom. What? No, she, she, she can't come over here. 
Uh, Marley, I think that we could just get along, right? I don't know about that. You're really annoying. But you're annoying too. And this is precisely why your grandmother is coming to watch you. Oh, no. Everybody knows that we have the strictest grandmother in the entire world. Never fear, your grandmother is here. Well, good. Maybe you can tell Daisy to be um like a little less annoying by like a thousand percent. Me annoying? You're the one they blah 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 blahs all the time. You never stop talking, not ever, uh -oh. and your stomach never stops growling evil. Okay, girls, that's quite enough. The next person that complains is grumpy, has a sour attitude, or fights, will be, um, cleaning out the toilets. Say what? Granny, you bonkers. <laughs> like, seriously, I'm not cleaning out a toilet. <laughs> Molly, you farted. Maybe you need to use the toilet. <laughs> hey, don't tease me. I had a bean burrito for lunch. I feel good, yeah. Well, you can complain a little bit because you're sick. That's totally acceptable. But you bigger girls, there's nothing wrong with you. Now get to doing your homework. Homework, small work. Triple bar, won't work. Really, Marley, that didn't even make sense. That's what I mean. You always yak, yak, yakin'. Shh, I'm trying to concentrate on this math homework. It's very difficult. It's making my brain feel like it's going to melt. Well, I'm done with my homework, so I get to just sit here and play on my iPad. Blah, blah, blah. Don't sit next to me. You're sitting too close. You're annoying. What? No, I'm not. Why can't I sit here? You smell like a, like a stinky monkey. You're so rude. How come you're even my sister? Get back here. I'm going to pull your pigtails. Oh my, you girls stop that right now or both of you will be scrubbing the toilet. But, but Grandma, she's being so annoying. She's being so annoying. You know what? I warned you girls and now I can see not even scrubbing toilets is going to solve this problem. So I've decided that for the next two 24 hours, you're both grounded to your room. Say what? Are you kidding me? Well, I guess I was right and you're wrong. I said both of you, Daisy. Wait, what? But we share a room. That would mean we'd both be stuck in the same room together for 24 hours. Are you crazy? I'm as serious as a heart attack. Whoa, that does sound serious, Grandma. That's right. I will bring you your meals in your room. Neither one of you are to leave. What if you have to go potty? You get a one minute pass. To go to the bathroom? But sometimes if you've eaten a bean burrito, I need more than a minute. Well then, you will have to spend 48 hours in your room. No, a minute's good. A minute's good. I can't believe I'm being punished. What did I ever do? You just merely exist, Daisy. You just merely exist. You two are going to learn to like each other. Or you're going to fight the entire time, but I won't have to hear it. I'm just going to close your door and turn down the volume on my hearing aid. <laughs> oh, Grandma. <sighs> now I know why I like Susie the babysitter better. This half of the room is my half. And that half of the room is your half. <gasps> well, what happens if my bed is on your half? Well, I guess you don't get to sleep in it then, do you? Molly, you are the most annoying sister ever. Ditto, Daisy. Ditto. Molly, are you seriously jumping on my bed? You should be grounded. Too late. Already am. And you're stuck in this room with me. <laughs> Please help me. Please, anyone. SOS. No one can save you, Daisy. That's it. I'm going to get even with you. And you're not going to like it. You get even with me? <laughs> That's laughable. Good night. I'm going to sleep. Good luck trying to sleep, Molly. I'm about to do my workout. One, two, three, four. La, 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 la. Oh, you can't breathe.
breathe, huh? Well, breathe in this one. Oh, Molly, I'm stuck in this womb with you. Yep, and there's more bean burritos where that one came from. <laughs> ah, my life is over. I can't deal with this anymore. How have I been cursed with such an evil sister? Ah. <laughs> I'm the winner, I'm the winner. There's no winner here, Molly. We're both losers. This is so annoying. Wait, what are you doing? I'm going to practice my drumming. Daisy, you don't even know how to be a drummer. Well, I think that'll annoy you the most. Well, well, I'm eating more bean burritos. Drum solo. Ew, what's that smell? Molly, you're gassing out the whole room. <laughs> I win. I'm the most evil sister. Not a chance, Molly. I got more with... <coughs> okay, Molly. Yeah. Oh, I can't breathe! I can't breathe! <laughs> That's it. I gotta make something smell better in you. These are lavender scented tiki torches. Uh-oh! Dizzy, you can't use tiki torches inside. I'll use anything to get rid of that stinky bean burrito smell. One minute, 37 seconds later. Are you serious right now? I locked you in your room so you behave and you caught the house on fire? That's it. I quit. Ew, Grandpa, why'd you take your teeth out? Oh, look, he's been eating the cookies we baked for them. Why are they, they that funny color? I don't know. They didn't look like that when I brought them over. Grandpa, are you feeling okay? Whoa! Grandpa, you're all green. What's wrong with you? Uh, you evil grandkids. Evil? Ew, look at the nose hairs coming out of Grandpa's nose. Grandpa, remind me for next Christmas that you need some nose hair trimmers. Ugh. You kids poisoned those cookies. Now you're gonna pay. Get back here, you little brats. Huh? Grandpa, no, 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 no. We, we didn't poison the cookies, we promise. Yeah, Grandpa, we did it. Don't try to get us. You're going to daycare with the other little baby brats. Daycare? Grandpa, we're way too old for that. Well, get used to it, because it's where you're going to go now. You don't want to babysit us anymore, Grandpa? Seriously, my feelings are kind of hurt. Daycare. <laughs> That'll teach you. Ew, Grandpa farted. Okay, maybe daycare is not so bad. That fart smells really bad. What's going on? Oh my gosh, we're at Twilight Daycare. And he turned us into toddlers. I knew that grandpa guy was evil. He's not a real grandpa, Molly. He can't be. <laughs> you thought I was your actual grandpa? <laughs> this is just how I tricked you to stay in this daycare. Forever. Um... Ew, that girl just threw up on me. <laughs> I want my mommy. <laughs> See you later. Wait, why does he want to, like, keep us here forever? I don't know, Molly. I'm just glad he put his teeth back in. Uh, can you back up? You're full of puke, and I don't want any more on me. I just want to get out of here. I'm not a baby anymore. Well, you're still crying like one <laughs> for being so grown up. What? Is her name Karen? What's her name? Because she seems like a total Karen of a caregiver. She's grumpy. I'll go with this lady. You seem nice. Um, you look like an alien, sort of, but... Molly, try to be nice to these people. I'm trying, but I have to go poo-poo. Oh, boy. This isn't good. That guy took over our grandpa's house, made us think he was his, our grandpa, and basically locked us in Twilight Daycare forever. Uh-oh. Gotta go poo-poo. Where's the bathroom? Where's the bathroom? I can't read because I, I reverted back to being a toddler, so now I don't even know where the bathroom is. Wait, I found the toilet. I found the toilet. I'm so happy. Ow, why did it fall down? The toilet's so high up. Why did they make it high up when you're a baby? And why is this girl following me? She's following me, and she thinks it's funny to barf on me, and I'll just let you know that I don't find that amusing. Oh, but that little baby is super adorable. Cookie fan Brianna, you are cute. Cute little baby. All right, where's my sister? Daisy! <laughs> Daisy! 
Okay, my sister already found a way out, I guess, and I'm just stuck here. I can't believe this. This is like the worst day of my life, and uh, man, I feel kind of tired. No, I can't fall asleep. I have to find a way to escape. Have to find a way to escape. Wait, there's Daisy. What are you doing, Daisy? I'm going to get a drink. I'm so thirsty. And also, you miss story time. Daisy, who cares about story time? We have to get out of here. That evil grandpa, he's, he's going to take over the world. What? I don't think so. He's just old. He can't take over the world. He's too old. Daisy, old people are so smart because they've been on this planet for like a thousand years. They know all the tricks of life. And, 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 and... And I don't know, because I'm just a baby, so I can't tell you exactly what they know. But they know a lot, okay? Whoa, Molly, you need to chill out. Ugh, it's nap time. Daisy, you're getting stuck as a toddler. You don't want this. That evil grandpa's cursed us. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Oh, my sister is so dramatic. Come on. I think I know a way. Look at this. Baby escape. <laughs> And that evil grandpa thought he was smarter than me. Come on, Daisy. Let's get out of here. Hey, you two. Um, I don't think you're supposed to be out of daycare. Hey, wait a minute. Weren't you just a baby like a minute ago? This is a weird place, but we gotta get out of here. We gotta get away from that psycho grandpa guy. Uh, Molly, I just be quiet now. What? Why? No, he is psycho. Also, he's ugly. Super ugly. Molly, somebody's behind you. Um, I don't know who, because uh, everybody here, I don't know. And also, I need to brush my teeth. Yuck, they feel kind of gross. Are you calling me ugly? Ah! Oh my gosh, it's Psycho Grandpa. Psycho Grandpa, Psycho Grandpa. Hey, did you put your teeth back in? Now you're only half as ugly. I'm going to trap you in this daycare forever, you little brat. Now back inside. Oh my gosh, Daisy. We're going to be stuck in here forever. We're babies forever! I have to go to the bathroom. Um, well, you're potty trained, right? I don't know, Monty. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, wait. I get to brush my teeth. Oh, this is fun. Brush, brush, brush. Brushing my teeth. Wait a minute. I don't know if I can. I don't know how to brush my teeth. Wait, how do I forget how to brush my teeth? Add toothpaste to the toothbrush. Oh, okay. That I have to do first. So how do I do that? I don't, I don't know how to add toothpaste. Okay, maybe I gotta put the toothbrush over here and then... I don't know how to do this. It's really annoying. <laughs> Molly, you forgot how to brush your teeth? Um, uh, well, I got turned into a toddler. What What am I supposed to do? I can't make this go! Oh, okay, I don't know. Can, can you help me brush my teeth? Okay, now I'm also hungry. I'm hungry and my teeth are green. This is not good. Not good at all. Who took the cookies from the cookie jar? Well, I, I did, and I'm going to eat them. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Take that, annoying grandpa. Mm. That's the first thing that's made me happy in about an hour. <laughs> Ooh, it says prankster above my name. Well, that I am. That I am. You know what else? I'm going to try to leave again. I totally am, and you're not going to be able to do anything about it, Grandpa. Oh, he's standing right out there. Seriously? You're just camping out out here? There's no camping in Roblox. What? You're a prankster? Did you eat my chocolate chip cookies? You are the worst kid ever. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, guess what? I also have bad breath. <sighs> oh, you need to use some denture clean. I don't wear dentures. I have all my real teeth. And guess what, dude? I'm running away. Hey, get back here. Oh, that stinks, though. Maybe I should let you go and just keep your sister. Get away from my sister. Ooh, wow. this looks fun. Daisy, look at this. They have big slides and stuff. Okay, I want to go up here. Oh, this is going to be fun. Whee! Ow! Ow! Okay, that kind of hurt. <laughs> My plan is working. She forgets that she's not a toddler. <laughs> um, okay. I am really loving this playground. Uh, except for I can't move because I fell down the slide. Oopsie. Ooh, this looks fun. Whee! Hey, want to play with me? Hi, Molly. Yeah, I'll play with you. I'm hungry. I love food. Wait a minute. How did we get here? I don't know. Who cares? We're babies. We're babies forever. I feel like we were going and doing something, though. What was it? Oh, no. I live at Twilight Daycare now. Me too. I love it here. Now, where's my bottle? <laughs>
to our channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. We're almost to a million subscribers. Oh my gosh. Look at baby Robbie back here. Oh, you guys know I want to be baby Robbie. How much is it? 199 Robux worth it. Let's do this, guys. OMG. Watch me transform into baby Robbie. Um, all right, I already, I already bought that though. Uh, is it gonna morph? What? Did it, did it not work? Did it steal my 199 Robux? No, no, no. Oh my God, guys. I'm huge. Ah, I'm gonna get you all. <laughs> Look at my eyes. Um, I might wanna see an eye doctor. I'm having some problems. Oh, Molly, you have a stinky diaper. <laughs> 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 I pooped my diaper. Molly, we have to find seven bears to open this secret door. I'm baby Robbie. I can just walk through there. <laughs> no, you actually can't, Molly. You have to find seven of these bears. Fine. I'll find seven bears, and then I am going to open that secret door. All right, I need a crowbar for there. And also, I need 15 candies. I have to collect everything. Oh, I love these kinds of mazes. They're super, super fun. Look at that! A teddy bear and a bunny! Oh, wow. I'm doing really good. Okay, one, one um, teddy bear. Holy guacamole, guys! I thought this was an obby. Turns out, no. It is not an obby. It's like a piggy escape game, I think. Yeah, Marty, but um, baby Robbie is coming near you. So if I were you, I would move on out of there. But, but I'm going to get another teddy bear right about now. Oh, he was too afraid of me. That other baby Robbie was like, what? There's another baby Robbie? Yes! I am another big baby Robbie. And I have a big stinky diaper. Whoa, more candy! Hello. Ah! Oh my gosh! The baby Robbie looks evil! Look at that, guys. It's like zombie baby Robbie. Look at that. Ah! They're crawling all creepy and stuff. Daisy! Hi, baby Robbie. I mean, Molly. Um, so far, I only found two teddy bears. Nine, five, three. Let me in here. Nine, five, three. Um, go. Wait, it says it's right. Incorrect. Whatever. I'm just a baby. How am I supposed to know where to go? There's another teddy bear. Do, 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 do. All right, guys, so far I picked up three of the teddy bears out of seven. And I'm hoping I can find some more. Let's go in here. Uh, okay, where am I? Oh, I'm back where I was before. This is confusing. This daycare is so confusing. And I have a dirty diaper again. Guys, look, I have a pencil that goes like right through my brain from one ear to the other. That cannot be good. I'm just saying. There's that evil, evil, evil one. The evil Robbie. All right, guys. I need to find a... What? That's a huge... Ah! It's a huge baby Robbie zombie. Robot or something. Ah, he's creepy. Get him away from me. Oh, my gosh. All right, guys. I'm going to collect this teddy bear if it's the last thing I do. Yay! Uh-oh. I am not safe right now. Definitely not. All right, I think I escaped that creepy baby Robbie. There's so many baby Robbies running around here. I don't know. Who is who? What's going on? OMG, guys. I just found... I think this is a gear. I just found one of the gears. And I can't run any faster because I'm a baby. Uh, um, I don't know where this gear goes, though. I just need to get back to the safe zone. Oh my gosh, I'm so lost. Oh, that one's locked. Okay, I need a key for that, but let's go find where this blue gear goes. All right, guys, I just also found the blue key. Ah, no, get away from me. I'm doing so good right now. Oh my God, guys, I actually found the blue door. Yay, Woohoo! Oh, I got a piece of candy for that. 
So we got a piece of candy. I found the blue door. Where's this gonna be? All right, guys, I have no idea where I am. Oh, it's to the green door. Okay. Oh, these games are so hard. I'm gonna make it happen though. What? Oh, the balloons pop too? But I'm a big fat baby. I'm supposed to get across here. All right, there's a red door. What's in there? I wanna see. More candy and some other cool stuff. Ah! Oh, wait, look, I can go through here because I have a blue key. There is a crowbar, guys. I just found the crowbar and more candy. Anything else good in here? Oh, there's a, what is that? Oh, it's a little Fighting Nemo toy. That's adorable. I'm just making sure there's nothing else in here, guys, that I missed, but I don't see anything. So, I have the crowbar, which means I can go back now. Okay, I made it. Phew. I can go back now and use the crowbar. Oh, it took me back to the safe zone. Bum, 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 bum. All right, I know now where I can use the crowbar. Cool. Which, wait, which way did I go out to get to the crowbar? That's the question. I think it was this way. I think. <laughs> I'm so bad at remembering how to get to things when I'm in games like this because they just seem like everything looks the same. And I know they do that just to trick you guys, but I'm doing pretty good. I have not heard from Daisy. I think baby Robbie may have gotten her. I don't know. No, but I'm still here, Molly. But barely. This game is harder than it looks. It sure is. And I'm so slow because I'm this baby, so I'm just like crawling like mega slow. Now, where was that platform that went up to the crowbar section? I know it was around here somewhere. Ah! Oh, there's the zombie baby Robbie. Bah! If it gets too close to you, it just like tries to kill you. Obviously. But that baby is a zombie baby, and it crawls really slow, so... Guys, I don't know where I'm going. Ugh! One eternity later. And there's the creepy zombie baby. All right, that was a dead end, guys. Let's go back this way. Let's see if I can go around this way to the red door. Red door! Where are you? <gasps> there you are, red door! I knew I'd find you eventually. Oh, candy, yes, I'll pick you up. Thank you very much. We're going to have six candies now, guys. Six candies. What is that thing? OMG, it looks like kryptonite. Is this to place it on the table? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Um, okay. Did it work? Is this to place it on the table? It's just kind of like making me frozen there. Um, I don't know what it's supposed to, I think I'm supposed to find all of these shapes. I want to place this here, but it won't let me. Okay, look, guys, here's the other shapes. Pick up, and let's put it up here. Dun, 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 dun. I think it worked. All right, now we have to go find the blue circle. I think that's up here, guys. Holy guacamole. Oh, look at that bacon hair prisoner. Poor guy. I wonder what he's in the big house for. I'm just checking it out up here, guys. I'm trying to see. Oh, there's another bacon hair. They're like cloning bacon hairs here. Look, there's another one. Now let's go put this on the table and see what happens. I think I still have to pick up that green piece, though, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I think so. See, it's like, like, it's too close. I don't understand how to pick this piece up. Did I already? I can't really tell. Finally, I picked up the black, guys. Oh my gosh, that was crazy. It took me forever. There was like a little glitch in the game right there. And honestly, oh, Daisy, hi! You finally caught up to me in the game. Uh, yeah, Molly, and now I'm learning circles around you because I got all seven bears and it makes you super fast. Well, I'm this big, silly baby, so I'm going to be, like, slow as can be. And I don't know what doing all those shapes did, but 
OMG! It opened up some stuff! I figured it might, guys. I figured it might. Alright. Oh, I got some potion. What's that do? A red flask with red fluid. Bum, 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 bum! Oh, wait, Molly. Let's get out of here. Ah, better. All right, I still have three more bears to find before I can actually get super speed. And what? There is big baby Robbie. OMG, this is crazy. I've got this red flask and this green key. I don't know where any of these things are. I'm just doing my best, guys. I think I'm doing pretty good. If you guys think so too, slam the like button. These games are actually really difficult, but I like figuring them out. So, let's just follow along the green wall. Maybe the green wall will lead us to the green key. Or, I mean, the green door. Then I can use the green key. Yeah, that's what I meant. Oh my gosh, what's all that stuff down there? Oh, there's a teddy bear. Yay! Oh god, there's big baby Robbie! I better just duck into the safe zone really quick. All right, I'm in, guys. Did he get out? Okay, good. Ah, no, he's like right behind me again. Ah, no! Did he get me? Oh, I hope not. Okay, wait, can I go through that blue door? Yes, I can. Let's go. Ah, get off me! Whoa, whoa, whoa. That made me feel kind of like I was going crazy. All right, where'd this lead? Guys, there is a green door in here, and there's a red door that I haven't unlocked yet. Look at this! It's like someone's birthday party. I just got the hammer. And I want a party hat. Can I have a party hat? What's that? Ooh, candy! Alright, I don't see anything else in here. Oh, it's a Huggy Wuggy doll! Huggy Wuggy was a blue fuzzy fuzzy. Guys, if you haven't heard our Huggy Wuggy song, make sure you guys go to the um, So Geeky channel. You can hear our Huggy Wuggy song. You guys will love it. I'm going to go over and use this red door. Ah! Oh, look at that. More candy. My favorite thing in the whole world. Don't tell my mom, though. <laughs> um, all right. Is that all that was in there was a piece of candy? I think it was, guys. I don't see any more teddy bears or anything like that. Oh, wait a minute. What? All right, I've got, what's that? Oh, a blue fat flask and a red one. And now, um, I already went through the blue door, so I don't think I need to go through there again. Whoa! <laughs> I think I have a propeller on my head. I think I got everything in this room. Yeah, I came in here. Because, guys, remember that giant, like, I don't know what that is. A raccoon or something? I don't know. I'm walking so slow. Wait, it's saying that there's still something in that red room, I think. What did I miss in there? Or is that on the other side of the wall? I can't tell. No, it's definitely on the other side of the wall, guys. Oh, look at me! I'm outside the game. I'm outside the game. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Staring longingly at the portal to leave. And, 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 and this giant crazy baby is chasing me! Ah! No! No! You will not eat me, baby. You will not. Uh-oh, better crawl in here. And quick! Woo! That saved my diaper tail. <laughs> is he gone, guys? Is the coast clear? Look at this, guys. It's some sort of electrical wire. I wonder what will happen when I push this. Should I, guys? All right, I am. <laughs> it turns something on. I'm not really sure what, but... I think if we follow this electrical line, maybe we'll find out. Oh, another teddy bear at the end of the game when I don't need super speed anymore. <laughs> well, that's just the way the cookie crumbles. Wait a minute. Why won't it let me push any of these buttons? Hmm, it obviously opens this door. Oh, those were just the lights to tell me which ones were left. <laughs> oh, that was so ignoramus of me because here are the buttons that I need to press. And there's got to be one more somewhere along this circuit. All right! Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. What's that? You can unlock that? What do you get if you unlock it? Whoa, no, Marty! Don't go down there! Wait, Daisy, is that you? Yes, I already won the game, but don't go down there because there's a giant... It's a trap! There's a giant baby Bobby down there, and he will annihilate you! Thanks for the tip, Daisy. Having a sister is sometimes annoying, but also sometimes useful. 
Whatever, Molly. I'm always useful. Ah, well, why didn't you tell me that baby was about to eat me? Oh, I'm back as myself. Wah, wah. But now I can get super speed. <sighs> okay, well, this is working out okay, I guess. Um, here's my super speed. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with myself. I'm so fast now. Whoa, whoa, get away from me. You can't catch me. I have no idea if I'm going the right way, though. <laughs> I'm just running for my life. Guys, if you want to know, it's 395. And, oh, it's a conveyor belt in here. This must be where they make all the candy. Guys, should I go in here? I'm not sure I should. Okay, it won't let me. What is this about? Guys, I don't know what's going on in here. I was hoping there'd be a piece of candy in here. Oh, look, it's a gears. Oh, I have to put the missing gears and I have them. Bum, 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 bum. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo! Wait, what? They're making... Ah! Oh, my gosh! What was that about? Uh-oh. This couldn't be good. Oh, I just got a badge. You fell into the Abyss Award. <laughs> that was kind of fun. Let's do that again. I want to fall into the Abyss again. Daisy, what are you doing? You said this was dangerous. Let's go in the basement. Show that but Robbie, who's boss. Um, I don't like this so much. What happened down here? Ah, Daisy! D I got eaten! Oh my gosh, are Daisy, are you serious right now? And and now I'm in jail? Okay, retry. <laughs> Why do I listen to my sister? She always has the worst ideas. All right, guys, now that I'm back here, you guys know I'm going to be baby Robbie so that I can show you what it's like when he crawls really fast. And he doesn't crawl really fast. So I'm resetting my character because that is lame. There, I said it. Sorry, but lame. It won't let me reset my character. All right, now I'm going to crawl to the exit mega slow. Yay. One eternity later. And here I go. Whoa, where am I? Buddy, I know this isn't the ending that you had hoped for. Um, yeah, considering this is creepy, it looks like it's going to bring more of these guys to life. Molly, I think we have to give them the, the, the formulas, the potions. Oh, let's see. Pour liquid. This is too weird. Too weird. Okay, got it. And... Bum, 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 bum. Now what? Now we have to press the go button. Don't say I didn't warn you. You got this, Molly. I believe in you. Well, Daisy, that makes one of us. But I'll tell you something, Daisy. I'm never gonna give up and I'm never gonna surrender because I can do anything. If you put your mind to it, woo, 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 you can do it. Um, then they come faster at the end, though. How is that fair? Whoa! Okay, you can have 29 more of my Robux, and then I'm done. I'm so done with you. <laughs> now, guys, I need you to slam the like button if you haven't already. And hit the subscribe button, okay, guys? We love our fans, and we make super fun Roblox games. Oh, no, DZ died, too. <gasps> okay, where's the first one going to come out of? Yeah, goodbye. Here's the next one. Bye. Next one. Bye. Next one. Bye. 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 There's too many! Ah! Guys, I can't win this game. I tried. I tried. Are you giving up, Molly? No! But right now, I need to go eat a piece of pizza because I'm starving. And I'll see you guys next time! Bye! I'm not late! I'm not late! Yes, you are, Molly. You were supposed to be here by now. Yes, but I still have, um, let me look at my watch. Uh, five seconds to get into class. <laughs> no smiling? That's right. I'm not feeling like I'm in a very smiley mood today. Whoa, who's this substitute teacher? I don't know, but something tells me it's not going to be a very nice day. Are you still smiling? Seriously, there's no smiling in my class. You can't help it. My face froze this way. It's so cold outside. <laughs> Wasn't that funny? Froze that way because it's so cold outside. Molly, she's not laughing. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yes, you in the front. What's your name? Molly, um, are you calling on me? 
Yes, Molly, what is it? I have to go, Potty. I have to go. I have to go. I have to go. You had plenty of time before class. Why are you choosing to go now? Well, I can't help it when I have to go to the bathroom. It's kind of out of my control. Why do teachers always say that? Like, like you can decide when you have to go to the bathroom. Hello? Not a choice. <laughs> I really have to go. She really does. Ew. She had beans for breakfast, obviously. Fine, but make it quick. <laughs> yeah, like another thing teachers say, make it quick. Like, I can really decide when I have to go to the bathroom and stuff. Like, seriously. I'm going to text Brookie right now. Hey, don't act like you don't text people when you're going potty. <laughs> don't even lie about that right now. Everybody gets on their phone when they're on the toilet. It's just, it's just like the real world. Oh, whoops. I forgot to turn off my phone. Oopsie. Whose phone just went off? This is school, not social hour. It's Molly. She's texting me from the bathroom. What? Why would she be doing that? Ay, ay, ay. She's just going to get another detention. It's just the way that it is. Brookie, why didn't you text me back? Excuse me, were you the one that texted her? Um, yeah. There's no texting in this school. It's a rule. Except for when you're at lunch or recess. Are you at lunch or recess? Um, uh, I'm always thinking about lunch. So I'm saying yes, I'm at lunch. Detention. But not by me. I'm a substitute. So I'll write your teacher a no. Oh, man. Rookie, that class was crazy, right? Uh-huh. Sure. Crazy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Um, So what are you doing after school? I don't have detention because the substitute didn't want to stay for it. So we could hang out. Uh, no. I... I don't think so. Wait, what? Brookie, we hang out every single day after school. Well, on the days that I don't have detention, that is. No, I, I'm i not going to hang out with you. Um, okay. I have to get to class now. Goodbye. Um, bye. That was weird. Brookie always wants to hang out with me after school. Man, I hope I didn't do something wrong. I mean... I always text her when I, like, escape off to the bathroom during class. And maybe it got her in trouble and she got mad at me. I don't know. I'll talk to her about it at lunch. Ugh, none of this even looks like something I would consume. Hey, Brookie, doesn't everything look delicious? No, I'm not going to eat anything. Why, you got the stomach flu? No, I just don't want to eat anything, okay? Whoa, Brookie, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Well, um, you could drink some of this water. Whoa, be careful with that, Molly. Oh, uh, sorry, I didn't mean to almost spill water on you. Ugh, I'm sorry. I'm doing everything wrong today, Brookie. It, it's fine. Just, just don't spill water on me, okay? Why? You gonna short circuit or something? <laughs> uh, no, th that's not even funny, okay? All right. Sorry. I'm on with my BFF. I mean, seriously. Hi, Large Mudge. Everything looks delish today. Oh, so glad you like it. I was going to put anchovies on the pizza, but I know you kids don't like that too much. It's good protein, though. Ew, fish on my pizza? Don't even think about it, Large Marge. Why are you so sad, Molly? Well, you see, my best friend is... She's just acting differently. Oh, well, maybe she's just having a bad day. We all have those. Yeah. Maybe. I need to find out what Brookie's doing right now. She doesn't want to hang out at my house. That's so weird. She was grumpy and jumped back from the water that I almost spilled on her. I mean, well, that's not that weird, but sort of. I want to know what's going on with her. Are we not BFFs anymore? I have to make sure she knows that I'm not spying on her. She finds that out, man. She won't want to be my friend at all. What's she working on? One more adjustment, and it be perfect. What is that? Brookie doesn't work on things in the garage. <gasps> My best friend is a robot! Is somebody there? Hello? Oh, better run. Oh my god. My best friend! She's not real! She's a robot! I gotta tell Daisy. Daisy! 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 Molly, shh. I'm trying to do my homework. Big surprise there, but, 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 but. Whoa, you look like you've seen a ghost, Molly. 
Have you? Um, because that would be creepy and we should probably move out of Brookhaven. No, worse! Worse than a ghost? Where could it be? My best friend, Brookie, sh 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 she's a, a robot! What? What are you talking about? Look, all of the signs point towards robot. She didn't want to hang out after school. Weird! She didn't want me to spill water on in the lunchroom because I think she would short circuit. Weird! Then I just went by her house to spy on her and... You spied on your best friend? I had to! And turns out she's not my best friend. She's a robot version of my best friend. I saw her building something for her robotness. Body. Whatever you want to call it. Robotness? Is that even a word? Body? Uh, no, I just made it up. But anyway, why didn't they come to me to school people on how to speak um awesome words? I obviously know what I'm doing. What? What are you even talking about? <laughs> anyway, I'm telling you, she was working on her robot body. Holy guacamole! You don't believe me, do you, Daisy? You never believe me! You always say these are tall tales, fairy tales! Oh, this is no fairy tale, Molly. And yes, I believe you. Truth is, robots have come a long way in the last ten years. And I think this is absolutely a possibility. You do? Oh, I was kind of hoping you'd say that I was being ridiculous. No, Molly, we definitely have to test it. See if it's a robot or not. Yeah, tomorrow we'll spill lunch on Robot Brookie and see what happens. Good plan, Molly. Good plan. There she is, Molly. She's not eating anything for lunch. Yeah, it must be her battery's low. She looks like she's about to fall asleep. That's it, Robot Brookie. You're going down. And then you're going to tell me where my real friend is. All right, Molly, let's do this. Brookie, I'm really sorry about this, but... Uh, what are you doing with that watering can? Do I look like a flower to you? Like I said, Brookie, I'm sorry about this. What? What? Oh! Short circuiting! Short circuiting! Short circuiting! Now! I've gone evil! Molly, something tells me she's a boba! Whatever gave you that idea? This crazy psycho robot that, that, that has half a boogie face and half a robot face. Something tells me cafeteria's closed. Um, everybody should run! <laughs> ah, crazy psycho robot, crazy psycho robot, running right after me. Molly, you wanted to do this, it's not your fault. Sure, blame me, blame me. Hey everyone in Brookhaven, it's Brittany. Your friendly news one person, yeah. But anyway, I just wanted to tell you that I'm here at the scene of, oh my god, here comes the crazy robot! Um, we have to make this interview very quick. Uh, can you tell me what happened? Well, I was serving lunch, and this crazy robot started going crazy. School's closed for the day because of it, and, um, well, tomorrow we should be back open. I'm serving sauerkraut sandwiches. I have to just say, I don't miss the sauerkraut sandwiches from when I went to school there. Well, then you don't know what you're talking about. They're delicious. And you should probably run. Crazy Psycho Robot's right behind you. Oh my god, guys! You heard it here first! Brittany live at the scene being chased by the Crazy Psycho Robot! Stay inside! Lock your doors, people! Stay safe! Wait, is that one of the students? Run! Um, I'm so... So afraid I couldn't run! No, run! Seriously! Okay, I was afraid though! I thought maybe if I didn't move, she wouldn't see me. Wrong answer, kid! Oh my god, this is the craziest day of my of my professional life. Time to lock the doors and board up all the windows! I'm just so glad I got home safe. But now I want to know if that's Robot Brookie. Where's real Brookie? Mm. Having that robot take over my life was the best thing I ever did. Eating snacks on the couch while everybody else does homework. Perfect. Breaking news, breaking news, breaking news. Um, we have to make this interview very quick. I got sandwiches from when I went to school there. Well, then you don't stay sick. Wait, is that one of the students? Run! Um, I'm oh my gosh. Maybe having a robot me was a really bad idea. Oopsie. Ah, what a beautiful day.
day outside. The sun is shining. Oh, it's going to be a great day. I don't have school, so I can do whatever I want. Woohoo! Sounds like a great day to me. No school? Yeah. Go see if my mom's making breakfast yet. Mom! Mom! Good morning, Marty. We're watching this really good movie. What? You're watching a movie without me? Well, you weren't out of bed yet, and we figured maybe you wanted to sleep in. Yeah, Molly, we figured you wanted to sleep in. Well, I sort of did, and I woke up and I realized I didn't have school today, and I was like, yeah, I don't have school! What do you want to do today, Molly? I was thinking that we could go to the park and play. Ooh, Molly, that sounds like fun. It was supposed to rain today, though. Yeah, but look outside. It's not raining now. I don't see a drop of rain outside. Looks pretty nice out. And it looks like our friends are at the park. That sounds like a great idea, Molly. Mom! Mom, can we go to the park? Yes, but be careful and stick together, okay, girls? I promise we will, Mom. I'll see you later. Do 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 ba 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 do do Going to the park. Molly, you forgot to unlock the door. Jeez. Daisy, you don't know how to lock, unlock the door? Oh my goodness. Go ahead, Daisy. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Ha ha ha! Uh oh! Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to, like, totally lock the door on you guys. <laughs> Whoops! I'll see you guys at the park, though, okay? Whoa, Molly, look at all these people here! Yeah, that's because the park is a ma- Daisy! I was gonna sit in that one! No fair! Molly, sit in the other one, cease. I always sit in the left swing. Or the right swing, I mean. Molly, you don't even know which swing you sit on. Fine, I'll go somewhere else. Thank you, Daisy. Jeepers creepers. Okay, let's see if I can swing on this. Why is my swing broken? Daisy, is that why you let me swing on that? Yeah, Molly, it's not working. <laughs> Daisy! Ooh. Okay, I'm going to try to jump over these. Without falling. Boing, boing. Yeah, I did it! Wah! Ah! Oh my gosh! Ah! I'm inside the back of an ambulance! First it tried to run over me, and now I'm like inside of it. Let me out! Okay, that was so weird. <laughs> that was so weird. Ah! There's a doctor chasing me! Molly, what is going on? I don't know. This ambulance was backing up, and all of a sudden, like, there was, um... They put me inside the ambulance, and ugh, it was crazy. Whee! Hey, Molly, you ran into me. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, didn't you know you're never supposed to stand in front of a swing? <laughs> Molly, say you're sorry. That's what Mom would say. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to run into you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, Molly, you're going really high. Keep going, keep going. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't stand in front of me. You're gonna get hit! Don't stand in front! Oh my gosh! Okay, good. She's far enough away. I don't want you to get hit right now because that would really hurt. Whoa! 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 Molly, you're going so high right now. Don't jump. Why not? The jumping part's the most fun! <laughs> you're crazy, Molly. Seriously. Do, 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 do. Ooh, look at this. This is new. I feel like I'm driving a boat. Now I want to go down the slides. Like all of them. Except for that one because I kept getting stuck. I'm too chubby! Whee! Molly, you're supposed to sit down and go down the slide. Daisy, seriously, you are like being like mom right now. You are not my mom. Going on the swing again so I can jump off. Molly, don't jump up this swing. That's too high. No, it's not, Daisy. No, it's not. Yes, it is, Molly. On you go, super high on the swing. Wee! 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 Ow! 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 Ow, my ankle! Ow, it's hurting! Ow! Molly, what happened? Did you jump up this swing? Yeah, now my ankle, uh, it really hurts. I think I twisted it. Oh, no, Molly, I think baby you should go to the doctor. What's going on over here? Uh, uh, I keep jumping on the swing. What What happened? Uh, 
Molly hurt her ankle. Yeah, Dad, it really hurts. Oh, no, Molly. It sounds like maybe you need to go to the hospital. No, I don't want to, Dad. Please don't make me. You have to go because you have to make sure that you're okay. Oh. Molly, it's okay. The ambulance is going to come and get you. Or Dad on a motorcycle. Hop on, Molly. Well, I guess it's better than riding the, riding the ambulance there. Okay, Molly. Come on. Whoa! That girl needs some help. She had, like, an eye patch and... Okay, Molly. Get in a wheelchair, okay? Okay, Dad. I hope I feel better soon, though. You will, Molly. Try not to run over anybody in your wheelchair. I'll try not to. Especially me! Ouch, Molly! You just ran over my toe! Sorry, Dad. Hi, um... My daughter was playing, and she jumped off the swing, and... Hey! Someone just stole my wheelchair, Dad! Go get another one, Molly. Can't believe somebody actually stole my wheelchair. My daughter's having trouble because she jumped off the swing and she hurt her ankle. Oh, everybody knows you're not supposed to jump off the swing. I know, but she just did it. Follow me, sir. I'll help you right now. Um, get into a room and check your daughter's ankle. Ah, there's so many people here. I can't get through them all. Okay, in here. Surgery room? What? Okay, now I'm stuck in the wall. Okay, just go ahead and sit on this bed here so we can check out your ankle. Um, okay, if you say so. I don't know about this. Don't worry, Molly. Everything will be fine. Okay, so what part of your ankle hurts? Um, all of it. Ooh, that doesn't sound very good. Let me take a look. By the way, you can call me Dr. Max. Thanks, Dr. Max. I know she'll feel better as soon as she gets all fixed up here at the hospital. Um, does anybody notice that basically my wheelchair is haunted right now? What are you talking about, Molly? Ah! It is totally haunted! Look at it! It's moving on its own! Oh, uh, yeah, it's her left ankle. Dad, <laughs> you were really worried about that being haunted, weren't you? Oh, uh, yeah, because it is haunted. I'm just going to sit in it because seriously, I want it to stop <laughs> moving around. That's creeping me. Creeping me out. Uh, well, I hate to tell you this, guys, but her ankle is definitely broken. Broken? No! The no! Oh, my gosh. I have to say something to Dr. Max. No! I can't spell no. <laughs> I'm gonna put a cast on her ankle. I'm not your mama. I'm sorry. This is the wrong room. I know how you feel, little baby. Seriously, I want to cry right now, too, because I don't want to get a cast. It'll be okay, Molly. Don't worry. I'm here. Thanks, Dad. As soon as I get done putting your cast on, then I'm going to give you some medicine so your ankle won't be in pain. Okay, I guess I can do this. Then you have to get lots of rest. Thank you. Okay, let me just get out my handy little first aid kit. Has anybody seen my daughter? Yeah, she was in here running around. Now there's another baby. Whoa, there's a lot of babies at the hospital today. Oh, I just got a cast on my ankle. Oh, man. Let me see if it lets me pick out a really cool one. I don't know. Let me see. It might not let me pick out a cool one. I'm kind of hoping it does. Okay, pants. I don't see any casts in here at all. Nope. Well, I used one of those really cool invisible casts. Invisible casts? Are you serious right now? Totally. But just remember, don't walk around on your cast, okay? You're free to go. Yay! Ugh, I hope I never have to come back here ever again. Thanks, Dr. Max. We really appreciate it. Now, Molly, what do you say we go get a donut? Yeah, that sounds good to me. Wee! 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 Oh no! Molly accidentally turned into a baby! 
Oh no, now she's a little baby with a cast. <laughs> Molly, come back here! You can't be a little baby! You're you're not a little baby! Day can't get any worse. Wee! Oh no, she's gonna run into the house. Molly. That's right. I'm taking you back to the hospital and turning you back into a a a a, a first grader. No, 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 no. Oh. How did I end up with a baby Molly again? This has been the craziest day ever. Here comes Brookie now. Good morning, Molly. Good morning, Daisy. Good morning. Oh, Molly, I love your um autumn scarf. That's so cute. Yeah, she's been talking about it all morning. Something about getting ready for Halloween and stuff. Yeah, I'm so excited for Halloween and for fall and stuff. I don't know. I just I like when the leaves all change colors and stuff. Yeah, me too. But, um, Molly, your scarf looks adorable, but, um, you forgot something. Oh, my gosh. You're right. I forgot to get a pumpkin spice latte from, from, from Starbucks. Oh, my gosh. My day's going to go terrible now. No, Molly, that's not what you forgot. It isn't? Oh, my gosh. I forgot a, a pumpkin spice um donut from, from Starbucks. Oh, man, I don't have a pumpkin spice latte or a donut. This is going to be a doubly bad day. <laughs> no, Molly. What I meant is you forgot your book bag. Wait, what? Yeah, did you forget your homework again? Oh, man, I was so busy putting on this adorable scarf that I forgot my backpack. Oh, I'm definitely going to get detention now. Well, Molly, you could hurry up and do your homework right now. Yeah, it was just a handout. You could go make a copy and then do your homework really quick before the bell rings. Huh, I think it's going to be too late. It's definitely going to be too late. <laughs> Not me. I always think of the best excuses. Good morning, class. Happy fall. Molly, you took my seat rude. Uh, I'm sitting here because I want to be the best student ever. Sitting right in the front row, of course. Right, Mrs. Smith? Uh, sure, Molly. <laughs> Turning over a new leaf, huh? Yeah, <laughs> a fall leaf. Get it? Because it's fall. Oh, brother. All right, everyone. Why don't we take out our homework and uh, we can hand that in. I want to get that over with right away. We want to see who did their homework and who didn't. Well, Molly. Daisy, shh. Um, Mrs. Smith, um, you see, uh, I did my homework, but there was this stray dog that was eating out of the dumpster. Oh, here we go. This is going to be a good one. It always is, Daisy. I can't wait to hear her excuse today and whether or not the teacher actually buys it. You guys, be quiet. Okay, this is the truth. I did my homework, but there was a stray dog outside the diner eating from the dumpster. I felt so bad. I went over to see if he needed help. I put my backpack down, but my homework was hanging out of it. I was like, are you okay, stray dog? He ran away. And then, um, well, um, somehow he got my homework out of my backpack and ate it. But he was starving, Mrs. Smith. I had to give him my homework. He was hungry. Oh, Molly. I can't stay for detention today. I have a date, so I guess you don't have detention. A date? Ooh la la! Ugh, my stomach feels kind of... That, never mind. Molly, I'm sitting right behind you. Excuse me! Oh, no, 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 I'm not done. Uh, teacher? Teacher! Teacher, teacher, teacher! I have to go to the bathroom! Oh, uh, okay, Molly. Are you just trying to get out of the pop quiz? No! No, 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 my stomach really hurts. I have to go potty, I have to go potty, I have to go potty. Uh, yeah, trust me, I'm sitting behind her, and it stinks back here. She has to go. All right, Molly, go ahead. Ha! Thank you! 
I knew I shouldn't have eaten that bean burrito for breakfast. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh my goodness. That's better. Just gonna flush the toilet. Wait, why, why, why won't the toilet flush? Oh my god, this is so embarrassing! And I'm not done. Alright, I have to go into this next bathroom because I still have to go potty and that one won't flush. Yep, definitely shouldn't eat that bean burrito. Oh my gosh, okay, I just have to flush. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This toilet, it, 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 it's starting to overflow! Okay, I'll just walk out of the bathroom casually like nothing's happening. I'm as cool as a cucumber! I didn't overflow the toilet in the bathroom. No, 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 not me. <laughs> oh boy, someone get some air freshener. Stop! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, the school is flooding! What? The school is flooding? What do you mean? The school is flooding and I think it started in the bathroom! Um, uh, the school is flooding because of the bathroom? Uh, I don't know what they're talking about. Didn't you just go to the bathroom, Molly? No. Daisy, shh. Okay, everybody wait outside the school while I clean up this giant mess. Um, okay, if you say so. Oh, boy, that's a little embarrassing. Good thing nobody knows it was me. May I have your attention, please? This is your principal speaking. There will be an early dismissal today. Oh, it must be because it's raining and we're going to get a storm. Uh, yeah, it looks like uh, we're going like, to drown in this. You're getting an early dismissal because somebody overflowed all the toilets in the girls' bathroom. And now it's flooding all of Brookhaven. Get on the school bus immediately and go home. Marty, did you eat a bean burrito for breakfast? Uh, uh, you're flooding all of Brookhaven. What are you guys talking about? Marley went poo-poo and it's flooding all in Brookhaven. Ew, gross! Um, guys, I think we better get the school bus and get out of here. Well, you guys should be thanking me. We got an early dismissal. <laughs> There's a bus. Come on, guys. Anything to get out of this doo-doo water. Gross. Yeah, you could say that again. Uh, Marley, why are you driving? I don't know, I think the school bus driver like quit or something. I quit too if I had to do all these early dismissals. Okay, Molly, well, drive us home. All right, here we go. I don't know, I don't trust Molly's driving. I don't know what you're talking about, I'm a great driver. Watch out for that sign! Oh boy, you really are a terrible driver, Molly. Are you guys sure that your mom won't mind I come over to your house? She's probably doing lots of work. Yeah, she works from home on Mondays, so, you know, no big deal. Okay, well, maybe we should just ask her first. Don't worry, she loves you, Brookie. Everything's gonna be fine. Mom, we got out of school early! Wait, what? Uh, what are you doing home? Um, well, uh... Molly ate a bean burrito for breakfast and flooded the toilets and all of downtown is flooded. What? Oh, yeah, you guys are kidding me, right? <laughs> what really happened? No, for real. She really did flood the toilet. Molly, oh my goodness. Don't eat a bean burrito again. Is it okay if I hang out over here? Of course, Brookie. Mom, I thought you had a bunch of work to do. Uh, yeah, I'm just taking a little lunch break. I was about to watch some TV, and you eat a Hershey bar for lunch? And you're always nagging me about eating healthy. Well, uh, I'm a grown-up, and you're a kid. All right, guys, first thing we do on our um, early dismissal routine is get a delicious snack. What do you guys want? I got waffles, I got ice cream, I got pizza. Ooh, pizza sounds delicious. Mm. I am so too. Help yourself to anything you want, guys. Mm. That is some delicious pizza. What do you guys want to do? You want to, like, ride bikes or something? First, I want to, like, just chill out and watch some TV. Because, um, yeah, I don't get to watch TV during the day that much. And I really want to because there's always good shows on. No, there's not, Molly. Really? The Puppy and Kitten show is on. Who doesn't like that? I like that. I love early dismissals. Mm. You guys should have eaten an apple that's in my child feel. Does she even know how to be cool? Seriously. Puppies and kittens, they're so cute. 
Ah, oh, I'm so glad I'm not at school right now. I'm taking a pop quiz. Instead, my stomach is full of pizza and my brain is full of puppies and kittens. Yeah, this is fun, but like, let's go outside and ride our bikes or something. Good idea. Come on, let's go. Have fun, girls. Be safe. We will, Mom. Oh, man. School bus got like stuck right there. <laughs> Molly, I love your bike. Thanks. I just got it. And um, the color green is like, it glows in the dark at night so nobody like runs into you or anything. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, where's Daisy? She said she was going to stay inside and do some studying. Of course she did. Whee! Uh-oh. Where's the brakes? Where's the brakes? Oh, ow, ow, ow. Molly, are you okay? Oh, I'm underneath the bus. Ah. Uh. Well, Molly, you don't look too hurt. I mean, besides the fact that you ran into the bus and it looks like you're missing some of your teeth. What? Missing some of my teeth? Wah! It's okay, Molly. I'm sure the dentist can, like, sew them back in or something. You want to go to the park? Um, uh, yeah, okay. Ooh, Brookie, look. It's the Brookhaven Cemetery. I double dog dare you to go in. What? You didn't even say, um, dare first. You just went to double dog. Yeah, because I definitely want you to go in there. I'm not afraid. I could go in there. There's, there's nothing in there. I gotta see this one. <laughs> right before Halloween, she goes into a graveyard. She's super brave. See, Molly, there's nothing in here to be afraid of. Not a single... Oh, my God! Is that a ghost? Molly, run! Ah! Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. <laughs> there's a ghost in the cemetery! Of course there is! There's a lot of dead people in there! <laughs> well, Molly, <laughs> this has been a pretty crazy early dismissal routine. Yeah, there was nothing routine about it. And, um, Molly, you might want to go have your teeth sewn back in. Yeah, I'll worry about that tomorrow. Right now, I just want to soak up this autumn sun while I'm not in school. So, Molly, do you want to tell me what happened to your teeth? Uh, well, uh, well, it all started at school because I had a bean burrito. Oh, boy, I can tell already this is going to be one crazy story. <laughs>
Now no Saudi's gonna know exactly where we are. Whoa, look at all these cotton balls. They kind of look like teeth. Are they cotton balls or are they teeth? I don't know. Still jumping, 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 jumping. Whew, I finally made it. Ooh, a stretcher. Can I jump on this thing? Whee. Ah, uh, there's a bathtub in here. Why is there a bathtub? Ah, I needed a bath. Just kidding. Oh my gosh, I already died. Well, I don't get that special badge. Are you serious? Do I have to go all the way back here? A few moments later. Molly, why you got gas when you come to the hospital? Because once I heard that the most visited, um, like the pe reason why people visit the hospital the most is for stomach pain. <laughs> and I got rid of mine, so now I can leave the hospital. Ew, Molly. I'm just saying, a lot of people have gas, they come to the hospital, they think they're dying, but really what they need to do is fart! <laughs> Molly, you are so ridiculous, you know that? What's well, the truth? Sometimes your stomach hurts and then you're like, <coughs> and you feel so much better, right? This person is not my sister. She's not, I deny it. Pickle and place chairs. Pickle and place chairs. Molly, do you mean pick up? Oh, I read that wrong, I thought I said pickle. That must be, I'm just hungry. Okay, I'll put this one here. Drop it. And put this one here. Drop it. And then I'm gonna climb over. And then I have to put more chairs right here. Woohoo! Okay, wait, what's that? That would be no Sally trying to kill us. Hey, don't let me catch you. Okay, can you come up here though? Oh man. Waddle, waddle, waddle. Woo, I just caught a bill. Oh wait, here's the big thing I need to push. Okay, I got it. Woo! Complete to drop box. Oh, this is gross in here. Look at all these hospital bills. That's where they belong, right in the sewer. Boing, 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 boing. Oh my gosh. I guess you're not supposed to get hit by the wheelchair, but kind of want to take it for a ride. Yeah, look at all the bills, guys. All right, that is hilarious. Why does it keep, say, pointing down? Am I supposed to just do something here? Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Daisy, I'm confused. What am I supposed to do here? There's Daisy. What do we do now, Daisy? Ay, 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 Molly, follow me. Oh, you're supposed to go up. Yes, that's why there's a giant airwell. Oh my God, guys, I just collected another bill. Apparently, I'm good at collecting bills. Whoa, stacks and stacks of paper. Oh, a save. Yes, I love when I hit a save because that means I don't have to go back to the beginning when I fall off one of these bills and go back to the bottom, which I definitely probably will. Ah, uh, yeah, Molly, you probably will. Oh, I think we're supposed to go this way. All right, there, we did it. We did it, we did it. Whoa. Apparently, we're trying to have our heads surgically removed from our bodies right now. That looked like they cut Daisy, but it didn't. It was just like weird timing. Are you saying we when we're going through saw blades, Molly? Yeah, seems kind of fun, doesn't it? Ooh, another bill. They've made it so easy to collect all these bills, don't you think? <laughs> Organic processing. What does that mean? I think we're going to process your organs, I guess. What? No, I don't want to start back over here. I'll die if it means I can go back to this part. <laughs> Oh my gosh. This is like physical therapy right here. What? Okay, that was crazy town. Wait, did it just launch me in the right spot? Cool. Daisy, don't we want to go down to the hazard ward? Molly, absolutely not. Oh, whoa, look at this down here. It's a giant brain. See, I think we're supposed to go down here. I don't know, Molly, maybe, maybe not. But I bet that there was a bill up there. It probably was. Trust me, I don't need any more bills. Whoa, Ooh. Daisy just died. Daisy just died. Thanks for rubbing it in, Molly. You're only supposed to jump on the dark containers. The other ones are definitely some sort of slimy ooze stuff that you can't touch. Yes! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I just fall in that? Ooh. Yuck! All right, I don't know where I'm supposed to fall right now. Whoa. Guess right here and then right here. All right, this, this Abby is really creative. I'm really liking it, Ooh. guys, so... If you guys like it too, slam that like button. It's called Escape Sally's Hospital. Oh my god, that's a big needle. Holy macaroni! Macaroni and cheese, guys. The side of holy guacamole. Are you done yet, Molly? No, no, no! There's so many food things I need to say right now to describe how crazy this is. Yes, I made it past the needles. Woohoo! I don't like getting shots that much. Woo! There's a bill! There's a bill! Boink! Got it. Well, I'm halfway there on the bills, but... Um, is it ever gonna come back? Oh, wait, there it is. What is that? A part of a brain? Ew! Gross! Whoa, guys! Things are about to get reals up in here. Look at this. Holy moly! I don't know if I could do this. This seems so hard! I can't skip the stage either because I don't have any Robux. Yikes! 
it's so weird when someone else is in the game at the same time, but their, um, their block, like, moves faster than yours. See? Like, it looks like Daisy's, like, on nothing, but she actually is on her screen. But on mine, it looks like she's just floating around doing nothing. Whoa! Stay away from those needles, guys! They are deadly and full of poison. Ah! I don't want to have to do this again, so I'm really hoping it doesn't kill me. Yes! Ba -ba -da -da! Where's the checkpoint? Give me it. Give me all the checkpoints. Oh, there it is. Good. Oh, this is like the bog of eternal stench over here. Up in here. Oh my god, just keep moving. That's what I say. Don't ever stop. Never stop. Ah! It stopped. That was bad. Never stop and never surrender. You can do anything. Never stop and never surrender. Actually, I'm just kind of following Daisy because she seems like she knows where she's going. Oh, checkpoint. That was so hard. Wee! And go. Yay! I made it, Daisy. I totally made it. Good job, Molly. More floating brains. Daisy, I'm so confused right now. What are we supposed to do? Come over here, Molly. It opened a door that says exit. I don't believe it. it sounds like a trap. Ew, these beds are full of toxic waste. Which means you fought it on them. No, we didn't, Daisy. Uh -huh. Now I did, though. Ew, Molly. Uh -huh. Molly, I'm behind you. Sorry. Uh -huh. Bean Burrito's working its way out. Patient drop off. Watch the gap. What? What gap? This one? Whoa. It's time for your chat. Ah! Sally, oh man, it's time for your checkup. And she came right after me. So this is what you gotta do, run. Run quickly, run, run quickly. Run quickly, run, run quickly. Uh, uh, I'm stuck on the edge. Oh my God, that was scary. All right, I, I probably gotta fight who is a boss so Molly just- um, What? She tricked me. Ah! She's rude and crafty, that one. Ew, what's this place? Wash your hands. Ah, ew! What, are we swimming around in someone's veins? Holy macaroni! This is cool! Okay, this is very cool. I think we're, like, around some germs in someone's body. Which is also gross. Gross and cool at the same time. Guys, I don't even know where I'm going right now. I'm just swimming around. Ugh, Daisy. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Swimming around in someone's body. Oh my god. Trying not to die, trying not to die. I'm so lost right now. I don't know where to go. Wait, it says go up. Okay, here we go. Swimming up, guys, swimming up. I'm not very good at swimming around in someone's um, veins. I'm just saying. Oh, look, it's like, it's like letting me run now. Okay, cool. Did I make it? Yes! Okay, where's Daisy? Daisy! She's stuck, stuck in the body. She's stuck in the body forever! Well, stinks to be her, I guess. Made it. Thank you for your injuries. What? Uh-oh. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, guys, I'm about to defeat, defeat the boss. Oh, my gosh. Look at her. She is evil. Let's take her down, guys. Whoa. She's, like, on top of this giant slime bot thing. And she's tried to kill me with uh, germs. Good luck. I wash my hands, lady. My mom taught me how. Okay, I think she's actually going to be pretty easy to take down. Oh, there's Daisy. She is stuck in midair. Daisy, I think you're frozen. Oh, man, are you serious? I got to the end of the game and I'm frozen? Hey, look, guys. I only um, got five of the medical bills, but I think that's actually a good thing. Like, it's like, oh, collect all the bills. It's like, oh, no thanks. <laughs> no, thank you. I don't really need to collect medical bills. Thanks, though. I will destroy this boss. I'm gonna destroy this boss right now. I'm gonna destroy this boss. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna destroy this boss right now. I did it, guys! She didn't even explode or anything. Oh, there's the evil queen one. Uh, Daisy and I totally played that last time. Daisy, I don't know why you're floating around like that, but I hope you're okay. My game is frozen, but I still beat the evil nose, so I'm super happy about that. Hey, guys! Thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe, and hopefully Daisy will fix her computer before we play anything else. I hope so, because that would stink if I couldn't. Thanks so much for watching, guys! We love you! Bye! Bye, guys! detention and I missed the school bus so now I have to walk all the way home oh I'm so tired it was such a long day what's that guy doing crawling around on the ground he must have lost his car keys or something
Excuse me, sir, are you okay? <laughs> ah! It's a zombie! Oh, don't be ridiculous, Molly. There's no such thing as zombies. Where'd you get that cool Halloween costume? Uh, something tells me that he's a real zombie. Ah! Stay away from me, zombie! Stay away! Brains. Is he still behind me? Oh, gosh, yes! He's still coming behind me. Oh, my gosh! Okay, maybe if I just wind him around these swings, he'll get all trapped up, and then and then he won't be able to get me. Yeah, that'll, that'll work. That'll work, right? <laughs> okay, he doesn't know I'm over here, guys. He's just running around. Uh-oh. <laughs> He's sitting down on the swing. <laughs> Okay, guys, I gotta run home. Wait a minute. First, I should take a picture because I don't think my family will believe me that, 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 that there's there's zombies in Brookhaven. I've got to pull my phone on my backpack and 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 take a photo. Yeah, that's what I gotta do. Say cheese, zombie. No, I said cheese. Okay, yeah. All you can say is brains. My house. I've never been so happy to see you, house. Oh my gosh. Uh, uh, Daisy! Daisy! What are you freaking out about, Molly? Oh, it's probably because you're gonna have to tell Mom you had detention again. No, Daisy. No, it's it's much worse than that. You got in school suspension? Molly. No, 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 no. I, I, I was walking home from detention and, and, Molly, take a deep breath. You look like you saw a ghost. Worse, a zombie! Molly, don't be ridiculous. Stop pranking me. No, oh, Daisy, seriously, I really saw a zombie in Brookhaven. I think there's going to be a zombie apocalypse. No, there's not, Molly. I don't believe you. Oh, really? Look at this. Holy guacamole! You, 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 you took a picture and some video of a real zombie? Whoa, that's YouTube gold. Or maybe we could put it on TikTok, too. Daisy, not the point! We're going we're gonna to be eaten by zombies! They, they all want our brains! Oh my god, we have to tell mom and then we have to leave Brookhaven. Okay, well maybe you should tell her she believes you better. Yeah, that is true, you fib sometimes. But have your photo and video as backup, just so we can show her the proof. Got it, Daisy. Come on, let's go tell her. Ah, <sighs> what am I going to make for dinner tonight? Oh, hey girls. Molly, did you have detention again? Um, yes, but mom, we have something very, very scary, drastic, and crazy to tell you. What? Are you girls okay? What's going on? Mom, take it from me. I didn't want to believe Molly when she said this, but it's the truth. There's a zombie in Brookhaven. What? What are you talking about? That can't be true. Show her the video and the photos, Molly. Okay, Mom, come look. What is that? It's a real life zombie, Mom. We have to get out of here before all of Brookhaven panics and, 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 and we can't get out of here. Oh my gosh, you're right. Okay, you girls go start packing your bags. I'll call your dad at work. If we don't get out of here soon, Mom, we might turn into zombies. Don't talk like that, Molly. Just go pack a bag. Don't bring too much. We need to be very mobile. Okay. Oh my gosh, what do I pack for a zombie apocalypse? I'd like to think of it as packing for a vacation. We're not staying in Brookhaven where the zombie apocalypse is. We're staying in a beautiful new town where there's no zombie apocalypse. Well, that is true, but I'm going to miss my friends. Yeah, me too. Here's hoping they don't turn into zombies. Yeah, here's hoping. Are you packed already, Daisy? I sure am, Molly. Daisy, do you think I should pack my metal detector? What? Why? Why would you need that? In case, you know, maybe you could detect a zombie or something. Molly, ma they aren't made of metal. Uh, yeah, but, okay, yeah, I guess I don't need that. How about my guitar? And then I could be like, la, 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 in case we have a campfire. Molly, we're not going to have a campfire. We're just trying to escape from some zombies. Okay, well, what about my ice cream cart? You know, that thing is amazing, and we can make some extra money. I could sell it on the beach, you know. I could sell chocolate ice cream. Molly, just pack some clothes and stuff, and don't forget underwear. Why? Um, should I not pack, like, you know, like, Anything else, like my computer or... Yes, bring your computer, of course, but like just like clothes, underwear, socks, a hairbrush, a toothbrush, toothpaste, you know, the necessities, not a guitar. But what if we get bored and you need me to sing you a song to turn that frown upside down and not think about some zombies? Ay, ay, ay. 
I think sometimes, Molly, you're already brain dead. Oh, Daisy, that's rude. Just pack, Molly, hurry. I'm packing the guitar. I don't care what she says. Don't worry, family. I'm going to take care of all of us. Dad, you made it home. Yes, and I saw five more zombies. And, and, it, and it's not good. They're going to make the announcement soon, and the roadways are going to get all clogged, and we're not going to be able to get out of Brookhaven, and then we're going to turn into a zombie family! Oh, man, that sounds awful. Okay, let's go get in the car and get out of here. Bye, Brookhaven. Bye, beautiful house. I'm going to miss you. I brought a little vehicle to help us, uh, so, you know, the zombies can't get in. Well, at least not right away. Only guacamole, Dad. You're super prepared. Okay, Molly, buckle up. It's going to be a bumpy, long ride out of Brookhaven. Really? Why aren't the roads paved? No, this vehicle is just really bumpy. Oh. <laughs> May I have your attention, please? May I have your attention, please? Oh, listen, Dad. Um, they're making an announcement on the radio. Maybe they're going to give away, like, free tickets to Disney since, uh, you know, Brookhaven's kind of zombified. I don't think so, Molly. Let's just listen to the announcement. We want to let you know that zombies are starting to take over Brookhaven. We don't want anyone to panic. No panicking, please. But we don't want any of you to turn into zombies. So we're asking you all to stay in your houses. Do not leave your houses. Uh-oh, we broke that rule. Not really, Molly. I mean, we didn't know that we were supposed to stay in our house before they made the announcement. But look, we've already made it to almost the line. You know, the line out of town. Whoa! So far, nobody's on the road. Well, give it some time, Daisy. I'm sure a lot of people will be on the road soon trying to escape Brookhaven. Good thing we got out when we did so we don't turn into zombies. Dad, look! It looks like they put a wall up all around Brookhaven! Yeah, but look, there's still one road we can get out of. No, they've got a construction on that road. It's closed. Well, Molly, this is kind of a circumstance where I don't care about road construction. We need to get out of here before the zombies get us. Okay, Dad, well... Put the pedal to the metal and let's get out of here. Mom, look, we're almost out of Brookhaven. I know, honey. We're finally going to be safe. Okay, everybody. Here we go. Goodbye, Brookhaven. Wait a minute. It's blocked. What? There's like a force field here. Oh my gosh. They've, they've, they've made it impossible to leave. But the zombies are in Brookhaven. You have to let us out. Let us out of this force field right now! Oh my gosh. It's, it's, it's official. We're doomed! Breaking news, breaking news. <sighs> the government has put a force field around Brookhaven because we are now considered a zombie zone and they don't want it to spread to the rest of the country or world. I hope you all remain safe and don't become zombies. This is our last news report. Goodbye. What? They put a force field around us and they're not going to let us leave? But they're zombies! Speaking of zombies, um, there comes one right now! Ah! Okay, um, guys, we need to go, like, right now. Where are we going to go? Everything's closed up. I don't know, but there's a zombie coming and I can't get inside this giant truck. We're all going to die! Ah! Well, no, we're not going to die, Molly. We're just going to turn into zombies. We're now being a zombie family. Brains. I don't want to be a zombie. I don't want to be a zombie! Ah! I had to be late for school. And I actually did my homework, so I want credit for it, you know? <laughs> Where's my math book? Where's my math book? Oh, I can't find my math book! Okay, um, maybe I left it in the chair. No, where was I studying last night? Think, Molly, think. Oh, wait, I have to go to the bathroom. Maybe it's in the toilet. Math book! Are you down there? <laughs> Just kidding. Although sometimes I'd like to um, flush all of my school books down the toilet. No, it's not on the desk. Wait, what's that on the table? I think it's my math book! Yep, it, sh it sure is. I'm just going to pick it up, put it in my backpack, and away I go. Molly, hurry up! The bus is here! Coming! Good morning, everyone. It's good to see you here, especially you, Molly. You're actually on time. <laughs> yeah, and I did my homework. Can you believe it? Oh, my gosh. What'd you do with Molly? Who are you? <laughs> 
guys, today mathlete tryouts are happening. I know all you mathletes would be amazing at that. Yeah, uh, more work and homework. Uh, I don't know about that. Hey, Molly. <laughs> it's good to see you. Uh, uh, I sat next to you. Oh, <laughs> um, yeah, I see you sat next to me. S sitting in that chair is, is nice. Oh, really? Why? Um, uh... Uh, is it because I, I'm sitting next to you? No, 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 that's not why. <laughs> it's because you're sitting under the heat duct, and so you stay nice and toasty. Oh, <laughs> I see. Okay, class, please take out your math books. We're going to go over lesson number three. Math book, math book, math book. Wait, here it is. O-M-G. I accidentally brought my diary. Oh, my gosh talks all about my crush in it. Okay, I'll just put it back in my backpack and tell the teacher I forgot my math book. Did Molly just say that she brought her diary to school? <laughs> I bet there's some awesome secrets in there she doesn't want anyone to know. And that's exactly why I have to read it. <laughs> when her back's turned, I'll steal it right from her backpack. Mrs. Stevens, I forgot my math book. I'm sorry, I... I, I brought the wrong book with me, but I did my homework. It's okay, Molly. Do I have to have detention? No, you don't have to have detention. Really? I finally managed to not get detention. I'm super proud of myself right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Molly has a crush on Luke? <laughs> this is perfect. Dear Luke, meet me in the auditorium after school. Love, Molly. <laughs> Dear Molly, meet me in the auditorium after school. Love, Luke. Perfect. <laughs> I'm going to prank her so good. <laughs> hey, Molly, you could share math books with me if you want. Really? Wow. Uh, Thanks, Luke. No problem. Okay, class. You guys can head off to English. I don't want you to be late. Yeah, that would be a tragedy. <laughs> Are you even paying attention? Hello? <sighs> Is she sleeping? Huh? What? Huh? Wake up. Huh? What? What'd I miss? Pretty much all of English class. Here, Luke wanted me to give you this letter. Really? Yeah, he said it's pretty urgent. Okay, thanks. No problem. Don't say I never did anything for you. Wow, a letter from Luke? I wonder what it says. Dear Molly, please meet me in the auditorium after school. Love, Luke. O-M-G. I think he's going to ask me to the school dance. Best day of my life. Okay, everyone. Class is dismissed. Wow, it's the end of the day. <laughs> Guess I need to meet Luke in the auditorium. Oh, my God, there's Luke. I'm kind of nervous. He makes me feel like really shy because I really have a crush on him. Hey, Molly. Oh, hi, Luke. Hey, um, so, uh, you wanted to meet me here? Wait, what? No, you wanted to meet me here. Uh, no, Molly. Um, I got your letter. <laughs> I didn't write you a letter. You wrote me a letter. No, you wrote me a letter. Sarah gave it to me. Attention, Molly and Luke. What is going on? This is Sarah, and I want you to know that <laughs> I read your diary, Molly. Ah! What? <laughs> That's right. I'm going to read you guys a little bit of what Molly said. No, Luke, cover your ears. You don't want to hear this. What? Why? And why'd you write me that letter and now you're saying you didn't? I didn't write you the letter! I'm guessing that Sarah wrote you a letter from me. And then she wrote me a letter from you. Why would she do that? Oh, I can only take a guess. Okay, here you go. Dear Diary, Luke is so cute. Huh? You wrote this, Molly? No, I, I don't know what she's talking about! This is really Molly Diary. It's not Daisy or baby Kira. I really like Luke. He's cute. He's adorable. He's smart. He is like an amazing football player. Love, Molly. Oh 
my gosh, I'm humiliated! <laughs> By the way, losers, I have locked you into the school for 24 hours. <laughs> have fun! Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm mortified! I'm so embarrassed! I can't believe she stole my diary and read it out loud! Hey, Molly! Ah! What are you doing here? This is the girls' bathroom! Well, no one else is around, and, 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 and you ran away before I could even say anything. Wow, the girls' bathroom is much bigger than the boys. O-M-G! Get out of here! Um, wait, I just want to tell you something. I... I like you, too. Wait, what? You do? Yup, I do. I think you're cute, and amazing, and smart, and funny, even if you don't do your homework. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. And I'm kind of glad that I'm stuck in the school with you for 24 hours. We can have, like, a first date. This is a date? Yup. If you want it to be, that is. I totally do. Aww. Maybe we should go to the cafeteria and, well, eat pizza. I love that idea! <laughs> Let's eat all the pizza so that they don't have any for lunch tomorrow and they'll be like, Where's all the pizza? And we can secretly laugh inside because we'll know the answer and they won't. Wow, complex, Luke. Okay, let's do it. I always thought you were kind of simple, but no. Seems you have a whole plot line going here. Ooh, this pizza's delicious. Mmm, it totally is. Molly, I hope that we can be the best of friends. Me too, Luke. Mmm, this is really good. So, um, what do you want to do now? Uh, eat more pizza. <laughs> Duh. Molly, I never knew somebody that liked pizza as much as you. Well, if we're going to eat it all so all the students wonder where it goes tomorrow, you better get eating, Luke. Um, yeah, I'm full already. <laughs> I can totally eat more pizza than you. <laughs> hey, want to go to the gym and play some basketball? Sounds like a great idea, except for I just ate all that pizza. I'll probably throw up. Nah, it'll be fun. Come on. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. I forgot where the gym was for a minute. <laughs> now that pizza went to my brain. Okay. Let's see if I'm better at basketball than Luke. Um, you probably are. I'm really good at football, though. I'm not really great at football. Whoa, good shot, Luke! I'm having so much fun right now. Me too. Um, Luke, um, we didn't think about something. What's that, Molly? Where are we gonna sleep? Um, well... Ugh, I don't feel so good. Why? Oh no, you ate too much pizza and then you jumped around playing basketball. Uh-oh. I don't want to throw up on our first date. That would ruin everything, wouldn't it? Um, you better run to the boys' bathroom. <laughs> I'll set up a sleeping area. Good idea, Molly. We definitely have to sleep here till the morning. Wait a minute. No students allowed. <gasps> Yes! In the janitor's room, there's a bunk bed. I'll let Luke choose if he wants top bunk or bottom bunk. Are you feeling better, Luke? A little. I don't know why I ate all that pizza. <laughs> <laughs> um, Luke, I was wondering, um, are you having fun on our date? I'm having a great time on our date. Yep. Well, I want to show you something. Uh, I'm not looking forward to sleeping on the bleachers. No, no, no. Look what I found in the janitor's room. Bunk beds! Do you want the top bunk or the bottom bunk, Luke? I'll take the bottom. Okay. Ugh, ugh, ugh. This ladder is kind of broken. I can't climb up the ladder. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Here, Molly, I'll take the top bunk. Are you sure, Luke? Well, if I can climb up the ladder, sure. Well, Molly, this was a great first date. I agree. But you know we're probably going to get detention tomorrow for being locked inside the school. But it wasn't our fault. We'll just tell them Sarah did it. Yeah, if they believe me. I'm always getting detention. Plus, we ate all the pizza for school tomorrow. Yeah, we might get detention about that. But at least we'll be in detention together. And, uh, Molly? Yeah, Luke? Would you like to go to the school dance with me on Friday? Um, uh, uh... It's okay if you don't want to. I would love to! Great. This 24 hours stuck in the school with you has been the best 24 hours of my life. Ditto, Luke. Ditto. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! 
I cannot wait to tell Daisy this huge surprise. She's going to be so excited. Daisy. Oh, Daisy. Whoa, it's dark in your room, Daisy. I'm going to turn on a light. Molly, would you please get out of my room? I'm trying to game. In the dark? Yeah, it's super fun this way. I feel like I'm really immersed in the game. Why are you in my room, by the way? Because I have a really big surprise. I don't believe you, Molly. I think it's just a lie. No, seriously, I have a really big surprise for you. I'm not even lying. I promise. Really, Molly? You have a surprise for me? What is it? Did you make cookies? Daisy, stop playing your computer. I'm going to tell you something cool. Oh, right. What is it? I talked to Mom, and she said, we can have a sleepover. Molly, we sleep over in the same house every single night. What's such a big surprise about that? No, silly. Brookie's coming over, and we're going to have a sleepover with her. OMG, that's amazing. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> I figured you would be. Now follow me into the kitchen. Why, Molly? I don't want to watch you eat another snack. It's all you ever do. Okay, well, I know that might be a little boring, but... Molly, I'm not watching you eat a snack. I'm not going to eat a snack, okay? I'm going to make some cookies. It's a celebration. Oh, I should make something, too, then. Oh, what should I make? Maybe some muffins or something, because I want to have variety then when Bookie's here. Oh, she's going to love that. Yeah, she's going to love your cookies a lot, too, Molly. I hope so. They're chocolate chip. Ooh, those are my favorite. Me too. I kind of want to eat the cookie dough. Molly, don't eat the cookie dough. There's raw egg in that, you know. You'll get food poisoning. Yeah, I know. Mom always tells me don't eat the raw dough. It's gross. <laughs> Ooh, now I just got to bake them. Tell me, Molly, my food is in there. What? But, but my cookies are ready to go in. Well, maybe we can make room for your cookies too. Maybe. Okay, let's see if they'll fit. Oh, never mind. They're done. Ugh, you're taking over the entire stove. Yeah, but now they're done, so don't whine, okay? Hey, guys, what's up? Brookie! Molly, what are you doing over there? Uh, I'm watching these delicious cookies bake. Wait a minute, you're making cookies? Absolutely! You're my bestest friend. Of course I'm going to make you chocolate chip cookies. But I made you blueberry muffins. Wouldn't you like to have some of those? No, she wants chocolate chip cookies. No, she wants blueberry muffins. Cookies! Muffins, Molly. Cookies! Um, guys, I'm really hungry. I just got done working out at the gym. I'll have one of each, please. She's eating my muffin first. That means she likes me better. No, it doesn't. It just means that my cookies aren't out of the oven yet. Ouch, ouch. Hot, hot, hot. Oh, no. Did I burn them? <laughs> Molly, burned your cookies. Only a couple on the top, Molly. It's not a big deal. Yeah. I don't mind a burnt cookie either. If you just dip, dip them in milk, it's still delicious. Mmm. Yum. Okay, Brookie, eat one of my non-burned cookies. Okay, Molly. Ooh, these look delicious. She's gonna like my muffins, battle. No, she's not. Who could that be? Everybody's here for the sleepover. Well, maybe it's a surprise guest. We aren't allowed to have a surprise guest, are we, Molly? I don't know. I only asked if Brookie could come over. Who is it? Hey, what's up? Can I come in? Uh, Sarah, what are you doing here? Oh, great. I'm so glad you opened the door. Finally, what could you be any more rude? Oh, Sarah, what are you doing here? Oh, who farted? Sorry, it was me. <laughs> Those blueberry muffins kind of, well, made me gassy. <laughs> it's okay, Bruggy. Ugh, yucky, stinky. Ugh, so gross. Total losers. Wait a minute. What are you doing in my house? And why are you eating all my cookies? Those are for my best friend. Oh, well, I guess I'm your best friend now because these cookies are mine. Someone said you were having a sleepover and, um, well, I'm here to crash it. Who told you there was a sleepover? Oh, I think that would be Brookie, wouldn't it? I'm sorry, guys. I just mentioned that I was really excited about coming to the sleepover. I saw Sarah at the library. I I'm really sorry. Oh, Brookie! 
Oh, well, I guess it's going to be a party of four. Do you have anything to drink? I'm so thirsty. Uh, usually it's kind of rude to just get in someone's refrigerator. If you don't live there, that is. Oh, I just got in your refrigerator, Molly. Yeah, but you're my best friend, so okay. I don't even know what to say right now. Boy, Molly, talk about putting your foot in your mouth. <laughs> hey, don't drink all the milk. We need that for the cookies. Oh, wait. Never mind. You ate all the cookies. Okay, so what are we doing at this sleepover? Well, I thought first we could um go jump on the trampoline for a while and swing on the swings and stuff. That sounds fun, right? Yeah, I guess. Whee! Come on, guys. This is so much fun. Marley, I don't know. Maybe our guests won't have fun at our sleepover. What are you talking about? I don't know. It just... I mean, Sarah was here and she's kind of rude. I'm having a great time. Don't worry about me, guys. Okay. Whee! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Blueberries make my stomach kind of crazy. <laughs> I knew you'd like the chocolate chip cookies better. I'll be right back. Uh-oh. I think Brookie had to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Molly, do you think Sarah will ruin our sleepover? I don't think so, but I hope not. Speaking of Sarah, I better go check on her. Why isn't she outside? What is she doing? Oh, look at this. Molly's diary. What? Get out of there. Get off my computer right now. Okay, I gotta unplug my computer. Hey, I was using that. That is not yours. Now please go outside with everyone else at the sleepover. Fine. What a party pooper you are. OMG, Sarah. You're making me crazy. Oh, finally. Marty, is everything okay? Yeah, don't worry about a thing, Daisy. Don't worry about a thing. Okay, I'm back. I hope you feel better now, Brookie. Totally. Why did she feel good? Oh, no reason, Daisy. Don't worry about anything. She didn't like your blueberry muffins. Molly, I didn't say that. Okay, it makes her stomach upset. Really? I'm so sorry. Oh, they were delicious, Daisy. Don't worry about a thing. Molly, don't be mean. Okay, I'm sorry. Hey, guys, you want to go in and watch a movie? Sure, but where's the fourth person at? You know, Sarah? I don't know. Hopefully she's not getting herself into more trouble. I just realized there's a snowman in the pool. Haha, <laughs> weird. Sarah, where are you? Sarah! Molly, where could she have gotten to? She's probably getting into trouble. I don't know. I don't see her anywhere. I'm going to go back into the backyard and see if I can find her out there. Ugh, I wanted pizza. This party's so lame. Sarah! Get, get out of my mom's car! What are you doing? See you later. I'll be back later, loser. Sarah! O-M-G! Daisy! Molly, is everything okay? Oh my gosh. No! Sarah just took my mom's car to go get pizza! What? Does she even have a driver's license? I don't know. But, um, I think I better call my mom. What's going on, guys? Bailey colored unicorn! Molly, get out in front of the TV! We have a bigger problem than that. What is it, Molly? I mean, you standing in front of Bradley Colored Unicorn really is a problem for me. <sighs> Sarah just took Mom's car to get pizza. What? Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm going to go call Mom. I'll be right back. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. She's going to be so mad. She's going to be so mad. Hey, Daisy. What's going on? Mom, we didn't invite Sarah to our sleepover, but she came anyway, and then she stole your car. What? Okay, I'll call the police, and I'll be right home. Okay, are we all in trouble? No, Mom said that Sarah's in trouble. She's calling the police. Well, let's lock the door so she can't come back because I don't want her getting us in trouble. Good idea, Brookie. Now, come on, guys. Let's go watch a movie. Ooh, this looks like awesome. Molly, we've seen the Brightly Colored Unicorn movie before. Yeah, but Brookie hasn't. Oh, Brookie, did you want to stay here? No, I kind of like to sprawl out on the floor. I'm cool. All right, well, have you seen this movie? No, I haven't seen it before at all. It looks really good. Hey, guys, thanks for inviting me over to this sleepover. Even though my blueberry muffins made you... <laughs> 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 yeah, they were still delicious, Daisy. <laughs> I'm just blueberry intolerant. Even though that Sarah came and she was, like, being crazy? 
Yeah, that wasn't you guys' fault. I'm still having a really great time. I want to come to your sleepover like every day. Well, that would mean you'd live here. Yeah, you could be our sister. OMG. That would be amazing. <laughs> It's me, Molly, and I'm here with my sister, Daisy, and today we're going to take one of your requests and play it. So you guys have been asking if we could take some of these popular obbies and play them on hard or insane mode. <laughs> we're going to do it. Um, woo, 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 woo. What are you talking about, Molly? You can barely play these on easy mode. You're such a noob when it comes to obbies. No, I'm not. I, I'm going to prove to my sister that I can do this on hard mode. Well, at least she didn't pick insane mode. Oh, next time I'm gonna. Next time I'm gonna. Well, this doesn't seem so bad at all. All right, guys. Let's see how many whistles that I can get on hard mode. <laughs> guys, if I, if I complete this, then I can try insane mode. It really would be insane. What are you doing? You're in big trouble for skipping class. <gasps> yeah, yeah, yeah. Try to give me detention. Wait, is my dad over there? Uh-oh. Dad, what are you doing at school? Hey, Molly, we just came to cheer you on because, you know, you're you're doing this hard mode and everybody knows you're kind of a noob at obby, so... I'm not a noob. I'm going to prove it to everybody that I can do it on hard mode and, 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 and I'll be fine. What are these? Uh, Molly, those look like bombs. Don't touch them. What? I just got another whistle. So far, this isn't as hard as it seems at all. Boing, boing. Okay, yeah, I don't remember these um, button bombs. Oh, first death. I don't remember these button bombs in any of the easy modes. Daisy, do you remember these? Molly, they're not called button bombs. They're called landmines. Cheap was just such a noob. <gasps> what? No, no, I'm not. Yeah, oh my gosh, you don't even know what they're called. <laughs> all right, my sister's being really annoying to me right now. I might have to kick her out of this game and do this video all by myself. You better not, Molly. You're gonna need my help if this is hard mode. Cause I'm much better with Abby's than you are. Well, I have to tell my sister that is correct. Cause she is better at Abby's than me. But guys, I don't let that stop me. And you shouldn't let it stop you either. If you have a goal in, li a goal in life, you should work to achieve it. No matter how hard it is, guys. You can do anything you put your mind to. And I believe in you, okay guys? Out what, a, what one of those landmines do. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. They blow you up. That's what. But anyway, like I was saying, guys, you're amazing, and all you have to do is work hard, and you can achieve anything. Even if you think it's impossible, guys. Truly. Oh, man, it took me all the way back here, and then I stepped on a landmine. One minute, 37 seconds later. Are you sure they're not button bombs, Molly? I can call them button bombs if I want. I think I should have bought some um, some Robux before I started this game. Only because I don't have any, any and I might need to skip a stage. Oh, no, 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 no. If you're going to play on hard mode, there's no cheating with skipping a stage. Seriously? Wait a minute. Why do you get to make the rules? Because I'm the one that's so far ahead of you. Now, remember from playing this on easy mode that this is the white rope. Is this all that this is on hard mode? Is it you just have these um, button bombs? Why are you still calling them button bombs? Just to annoy you. <laughs> well, you don't have to try very hard at that. You're my sister, so you annoy me already. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm living I'm living on the edge right now, literally. <laughs> I wasn't even standing on anything. I was just standing on the air, but I didn't die. Love when that happens. I only... Whoa. It happened again. Whoa, whoa. I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. I only got two whistles so far. I was hoping for more, but I, I know I'll find them. Whoa. I am gonna actually find them. Do, 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 da, ba, do. Okay, let's go through this event. Oh, more button bombs. The landmines, Molly, the landmines. <laughs> whoa, calm down. You need to take a chill pill and relax, sister. Okay, I just got three whistles. I got another one, so I'm very happy right now. I'm trying to get as many whistles on hard mode as humanly possible. <laughs> Daisy, that looked crazy. Does my arm do that? Oh, yeah. 
When you try to hit that, your arm is like boing, boing, boing. It like spins around crazy. All right, I don't think this is that hard at all. I think, we oh man, I spoke too soon. I shouldn't have said anything. Wait, where did it take me? Huh, what? All the way back here? Are you serious right now? Where am I supposed to go now? What? Ah! The gym teacher just hit me with the ball! Okay, that was rude. That was so rude. Now I gotta start all the way back here. Are you kidding me right now? Watch out for that gym teacher, though. He's gonna try to throw a basketball at you or whatever. See? He just did it again. Ugh, oh, he's so rude. A few minutes later. Well, I think the key is to just keep moving. And he might not be able to get you! Many, many minutes later. And I'm gonna prove that to you guys in this obby right now. Because I don't care how many times I die. I am not leaving. Not even for a cupcake or, or a drink of water or anything until I make this. Well, okay, I might go get a drink of water. And while I'm in the kitchen, I might have a couple bites of a cupcake. But that's not the point. The point is, is that I am going to make it to the end of this obby if it's the last thing I do. One eternity later. This way I'm trying to move fast, guys, because I just... Oh, man, I made it to the next scene! Are you guys proud of me? I feel proud of me. I mean, I'm not saying I'm perfect, but... I worked really hard to, to achieve this, and I just got another save. All right, where do I go now? Ow! Hit me with another ball! Rude! No! You're not getting me this time there, buddy. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do! Melly, appeal! Appeal! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yes! <laughs> Wait, I didn't make sure I hit the save. Okay, I did. <laughs> Daisy, I told you I could do it! Congratulations, Molly. You're still a noob, but you never gave up. Never give up. Never surrender. You can be anything. Never give up and never surrender. You can be anything. What is he doing here? Ooh, creepy, creepy. Molly, I like your song, Never Give Up, Never Surrender. You should write that song and then, um... What? I see a golden whistle, Daisy. I've got to go get it. Molly, he's going to throw a ball at you. But it's a golden whistle. I must get the golden whistle. Boing, boing, boing. I got it, Daisy. I got it. I've got four golden whistles. Molly, I have to say, I am really proud of you and impressed. You work really hard at not being a noob. Thanks, Daisy. I try really hard. Guys, slam the like button if you've played this game um, on easy, hard, or insane mode. Because no matter where you are in Roblox, you're still so cool. Whoa, we're going up through the fan. Checkpoint reached. Bum -ba -da -dum, ba -ba -dum. Oh, more pipes we have to jump on? Holy macaroni. Cheesy macaroni. Ooh, that's making me hungry. <laughs> better stop talking about all this food. I'm going to want to have a snack. And I'm kind of busy right now. Oh, my gosh. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. Oopsie. Never give up. Never surrender. You can do anything. Never give up and never surrender. You can do anything. Whoa, I almost died right there. That would have been so bad. I'm like singing this encouraging song and it's like boink wham, wham, wham. that's the end of me <laughs> whoa i just made it to a save point and i was a little scared i wasn't sure i was actually gonna make it right there but i did oh not more of these it makes sense there's tennis rackets because he's a gym teacher do you guys like gym class i do sometimes depends on what we're doing oh i like when we use a scooter though Whoa, 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 oh! Ooh. Baby cannon. Use this to shoot babies at other players and slow them down? What? What are you talking about right now? A baby shooter. That's kind of funny. Like a, like a, like it's, it just like, I could shoot that at the gym teacher. Like, here, take a baby. You are a baby for being so rude. Yes, I finally made it. Oh, 
Oh, there's more. No, 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 no. There's more. You have to go over more lasers. If I had Robux, guys, I would buy all that funny stuff. But I don't have any Robux right now, so... Uh, maybe I'll get some money soon, and then I can buy more Robux, and then I can buy all that cool stuff. Molly, you, you can't shoot the gym teacher with it only, like, me and stuff. Yeah, but that'd be worth it. <laughs> Very funny, Molly. I thought it was hilarious. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No! Oh, my gosh, really? I was to the very end, and then I, like, fell off the end. Wait, I don't know which way to go. If you're going to tell us about healthy living, um, you might want to start listening yourself. That's all I'm saying. Molly, you're doing pretty good on hard mode. I wonder what insane mode is like. Let's play insane mode next. Yeah, after we go get an ice cream. It's summer vacation and I just want to chill. Yeah, but I want to win. Because I'm good at winning. Wait a minute. Did we just make it to the end? No, Molly, look at the timeline. We didn't make it to the end yet. Oh my gosh. It's the longest Abby of my life. Uh-oh. Now he's going to chase us. Now he's going to chase us. But he's not very fast. What are you doing in the hallway? You better run. Okay. Bloodshot eyes, Steve. Okay, I don't know where I'm going. Okay, this way, I think. If I could pick up um that ball and throw it at the gym teacher, I would probably do it. Well, Molly, there's also dog poo-poo. Oh, Daisy. Wrong. Can he follow me over here? Now he just stands there like, what the? Watch out for the button bombs! Landmines! I give up with this one. How could he be in two places at once? Something smells like... Like it's not true. Ah! Get away from me, you crazy guy! Crazy clone? Whoa! Watch out for the landmines! Um, guys, do you see a whistle anywhere? Because I only have four... Sometimes I'm too busy trying to survive, and I may have missed them. Okay, so far I don't see any in here. Whoa! I almost fell back down there and have to deal with that gym teacher again. Dude, it's summer vacation! Why are you... Okay, I gotta jump here, and then here. I think I do good under pressure, Daisy. Look at me, I'm doing better on hard mode than I did on easy mode. Yeah, you kind of have a point, Molly. That's weird. No, there's people in life like that who just basically... They do better when they're under pressure. Really? I always feel stressed out. That's why I'm always overly prepared. Not me. I fly by the seat of my pants. <laughs> Actually, you usually have smelly pants because if you eat bean burritos... <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Wait, do we have to jump down there, Daisy? I feel like we're just running in a circle, Daisy, and I think we have to jump down there. Daisy, are you listening? I'm jumping in the right location, Molly. You have to jump in the right location. Ooh. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Okay, let's take this one laser at a time, people. One laser at a time. Oh! Oh my god, I made it. That was amazing. Okay, I have to go over here. Why wouldn't let me go over there? What the? One minute, 37 seconds later. But I did. Oh, this was actually a better spot. <laughs> was this was a land way up here, Daisy. Sure, Molly. Um, it might be almost time for the epic boss battle. <gasps> what? On hard mode? I don't know if I can do this. Bam, bam, bam. All right, I reached the checkpoint, guys. Whoa. Okay, no, it's a speed run first, and apparently. You have to be in just the right spot or landmine. Boom. <laughs> Daisy, you weren't in the right spot at all. Boom. Oh my God. This is hard, guys. One minute, 37 seconds later. Fan is blowing you. Oh, a whistle. Yes, I got the whistle. Many, many minutes later. Part is very hard. The minute it sees you, it's like, okay, yep. Oh, don't make, let me run into the bat. Oh, oh I made it. Yay! Molly's so happy and proud of you right now. 
Well, don't say that yet, because I still have the opportunity to die a lot. I'm trying not to, though, guys. I really am. This ah! Yay! She called it a landmine, and then she died at the last minute. Oh, Molly. <laughs> Maybe I haven't been a noob this whole time. Maybe I just needed to be under pressure. Anybody think about that? Huh? 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 <laughs> well, it is kind of true. Okay, here comes a giant um, soccer ball. Oh, boy. Oh, different timing. Daisy's on different timing than me. Oh, my gosh. I gotta run so fast right now. Oh, I almost didn't make it. <gasps> okay, there it goes, guys. Molly, run! I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running! The one part I'm nervous about, guys, is the um, epic boss battle at the end. Because I'm just going to be real with you guys. Sometimes I really struggle to beat the boss, even if it's on easy mode. So, I I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do that. But I'm going to try so, so hard. That's all you can do is try your best. And I am going to try my best. Ah, that was electrifying. <laughs> I didn't even see that laser. It was like, blah, 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 blah. Hey, let's have a conversation. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Whee! Okay, there's a checkpoint. Yes. It tries to get you with the, um, the landmines. That's for sure. Whoa. Whoa. Daisy! I actually beat you! And then I died right afterwards. <laughs> One eternity later. This is gonna be the time I do it. I just, I feel it. Right in my bones. Uh, Molly, you gonna try to get the, the, um... The, the, yeah, that. You betcha I am. I'm never going to give up ever again. I'm going to show every Star Squad fan that I'm not a noob. And, okay, maybe I'm a little bit of a noob. But it doesn't matter because I'm not going to give up. And I got the whistle. Did you guys see that? Got the whistle. And I made it to the end. Yay! <laughs> Uh-oh. Now comes the epic boss battle. Whoa! Time to take this gym teacher down. Whoa, let's see how much harder it is, guys. Oh, there's landmines everywhere. So that definitely makes it more difficult because you cannot run into one of those. And you don't want the gym teacher to throw um, a softball at you either. Daisy, why are you just standing there? I'm cheering you on, Miley. Come on, you can do it. Don't you have to do this? Come on, gym teacher. Be gone with you. It's summer break. There's going to be none of that. Uh-oh. Yeah, I just died. <laughs> Whoops. All right, right in the beginning, you take him down quite a bit. Like, take his life down a little bit because... Oh, I'm going to hit you in the big fat tummy. Hit you in the big fat tummy. I'm throwing soccer balls at him. Or footballs, depending on what country you live in. Oh! Shout out to all the countries that are watching us right now. You guys are amazing fans and we love you. Oh, my God, don't hit a landmine, Molly. I'm, like, trying to do a shout out while not dying. Oh, too late. Would you please go away already, gym teacher? I've kind of had it with you. Holy guacamole, cheesy macaroni. <laughs> oh, I crack myself up sometimes. Okay. Guys, look at how much life the gym teacher has left. Everyone in the stands is cheering for me. And here we go. Goodbye, gym teacher. Yes! Boing! You can still blow up here, though, guys, so don't do not do that. Look at me, guys. Ooh, escape the bully on insane mode. That would be fun, too. Uh-oh. You haven't got there yet, Maddie. You haven't got there yet. Well, I did hard mode, so next is insane mode. I think we can do it, Maddie. I really do. I do, too, Daisy. I do, too. Guys, I've told you 100 times, and I'll tell you 100 times more. You can do anything that you love and you want to do. Just keep trying. All right, guys. I'll see you in our next video. Bye, guys. We love you. Hey, guys. Thanks so much for watching our show today, Brooke. Hi. Don't forget to check out our sponsor, the new iPhone. Guys, the new iPhone is amazing. You want to run out to your local electronics store and purchase it right now. Whoa, Daisy, did you hear that? Brittany says we should get the new iPhone. 
I know, she's such a star. I love her. Uh, but I haven't saved up enough money yet for the iPhone. That's okay, I know what to do. Mom! Molly, I'm right here. <laughs> you know the downstairs is all one room, right? Yeah, but Mom, I have a question. Uh, please stop crawling on the counter, Molly. I can't afford a new one. Uh, sorry, Mom. I'm just really excited. She's gonna say no. Uh, Daisy, shh! I haven't even asked her yet. Mom, Mom, Mom. Beautiful, Mommy! Okay, Molly, what is it? Spit it out. You are the most radiant, amazing mom on the entire planet. What do you want, Molly? Nothing. Just saying, you're amazing. Mm, I think you probably are going to ask me for something. Okay, um, you know how on Brook High they have the brand new iPhones? Uh, yes, Molly, but that's because they got them for free because that is the show that's like most popular right now, so iPhone just gives them to them. Yeah, I know, but... Uh, I want the new iPhone, too. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's a big ask, Molly. Um, I, I, I don't think that I can afford that right now. I'm really sorry. <laughs> what? But, but, Mom, my old phone is like a flip phone. It's so old. I'm pretty sure the dinosaurs called each other on my phone. Well, Molly, just be thankful you actually have a phone. A lot of girls your age don't have a phone at all. Yeah, Molly, try to be appreciative. Hmm. This app was delicious, Mom. Ugh, can't believe it. I can't get the new iPhone. I could have told you that, Molly. Duh. I cannot believe that I just won a bazillion dollars. What's the first thing you're going to buy? Uh, a new laptop, of course. They're also our sponsor for this video. Oh, my gosh. Now the stars from Rags to Riches are getting new um iPads. I definitely want one of those or a new laptop. Ooh, I could use that for school. I'm going to go ask Mom. Uh, yeah, good luck with that. I already asked for a new iPhone, and she said no. But this is for school. It's necessary. My laptop keeps freezing. Mom! Yes, Daisy, what is it? Dinner's going to be ready soon. My laptop keeps freezing whenever I try to do my schoolwork. Oh, man. We're going to have to take it into Best Buy then, and maybe they can figure out why. No, Mom, you don't understand. This this computer is so old, I can't use it anymore. Um, well, we're going to have to make it work because uh, I can't afford a new one right now. Even with all the overtime at work, I have to pay the mortgage and the car payment. And even your dad's mowing the grass instead of hiring someone else to do it. We have to all pitch in during this rough time. But, Mom, I need a new iPad or a new laptop to do my schoolwork. Daisy, I told you we could go to the Best Buy and see if they can fix your laptop. But, but, told you, Daisy. I knew she wasn't going to say yes. Hey, what happened to TV? Oh, I'm so tired from mowing that grass. It's like a thousand degrees outside. Ah. Dad, I'm so sorry you're dying, but what happened to cable? I need TV. Oh, your mother and I canceled that so we could save some money. What? No! No new iPhone, no new laptop, and no cable? I can't take this anymore. I've got to get out of here. I'm coming with you, Molly. Girls, wait a minute. If you're going out, I need something from the grocery store. Oh, really? We've got to go do an errand? Yes, Molly, please. I, I need some eggs so I can finish what I'm making for dinner. Okay, fine. Can I buy a candy bar? No, Molly. Of course you can't. You don't have enough money for that. But I want a candy bar. No, Molly, I need eggs. Don't buy a candy bar with that money. Okay, Mom, fine. Come on, Daisy. Ugh. I don't like being poor. Being poor stinks. I agree, Molly, I agree. Now remember what Mom said, Molly. No buying a candy bar as much as you want it. Well, hello there. Welcome to my grocery store. Hi. Um, I only have enough money for some eggs. Where are those? Uh, back right-hand corner. Hey Luke, what's up? Yeah, I'm just I'm just uh, working at the grocery store tonight. The lottery is up to hundred. What? The lottery is up to a hundred million dollars? I'm never going to the grocery store again. And it said that the winning ticket is in Brookhaven. Holy guacamole! I'm yeah, I'm gonna buy some tickets. I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna yeah, it's gonna be awesome if I win. I'm gonna move to the beach. I'm never gonna work at the grocery store again. Daisy, did you hear that? 
You what, Molly? The sound of my stomach growling? I hope dinner's ready when we get home. No, the grocery store worker. He said that the lotto was up to a hundred million dollars. Holy guacamole! He also said the winning ticket is at one of these stores in Brookhaven. Wow, that's insane. Whoever wins is going to be really lucky. Now let's get the eggs and go home. I'm hungry. Don't you see, Daisy? We gotta buy the winning ticket. How are we going to do that, Molly? Don't be ridiculous. We're going to do it because we're going to use this $3 to buy the winning lotto ticket. What? No, we're not. We have to use that for eggs. Yeah, but if we buy the winning lotto ticket, we won't have to worry about eggs. We could buy a bazillion eggs. Molly, how do you know you're going to buy the winning ticket? Um, well, um, I don't know. I'm just having faith it's all going to work out. What's going to happen is you're going to spend that $3. We're going to go home and there's not going to be any dinner. You could be grounded for a week. Well, Daisy, I'm buying the lotto ticket. Molly, you're not going to buy the lotto ticket. D Daisy, let me out of this car. Don't, don't you get, get, let me out of this car. I'm buying it. I'm buying it, Daisy. Get back here, Molly. You're not spending mom's money. I am spending mom's money. Daisy, did you seriously just put me back in the car? Daisy, I'm not three years old. Stop it. Are you going to act more mature about the money mom gave you? Yes, I will buy the eggs. Are you sure? Yep. Come on, let's go over and get them right now. <laughs> I'd like the um, winning lotto ticket, please. Well, there's no way I know if you're going to actually get the... Just sell me the ticket. Okay, fine. Here you go. Molly, no. You spent the money on a lotto ticket, Naughty! Naughty, you're grounded. Daisy, I'm not your kid. Stop putting me in the... Stop putting me in the cart! Fine, Molly. You're so naughty. I don't even want you in my cart. This is all your fault. I don't even know you. You're dead to me. Oh, my gosh. My sister's so annoying. Good luck with that ticket. You know, I'm going to buy the winning lottery ticket. Okay, fine. We'll see about that. Hey, Daisy. Where's the eggs so I can finish up making dinner? Uh, ask Molly about that? I had nothing to do with this, Mom. I cannot be blamed. Mom, Mom, guess what? Um, you were able to get a two-for-one deal on the eggs? And then we can have her for breakfast in the morning, too. No, Mom, I spent the money on something else. What? I told you not to buy a candy bar. I needed those eggs, Molly. This is what feeds our family. What were you thinking? You're grounded. What? No, I can't be grounded. I didn't buy a candy bar. Then what did you buy? A lottery ticket! What? You gambled with our money? Are you crazy right now? Oh, that makes me so mad, Molly! But you don't even know if it's a winner! Go to your room, Molly. Go right now! Fine. Well, Molly, that worked out real well. But when I scratch it off and everybody sees I'm a winner... Molly, you're not going to win. Well, let's find out. Daisy! Oh my gosh! Oh, Molly, what is it? Oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh! Molly, are you pranking me right now? What's going on? I, 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 Molly, stop talking dri gibberish. What's wrong with you? Did you bonk your head? What's going on? Oh my gosh. Is that a, is that a winning lottery ticket? For a hundred million dollars, Daisy. Oh my gosh. Uh, uh, yeah. I'll come back to you when you're actually awake. Mom, mom, mom. Molly. I can't talk to you right now, okay? I'm really stressed about money, and I don't have any eggs to <laughs> feed you guys, and I'm just really worried. I'm going to have to take another job, I think, if I can even get one. Mom, your problems are over. What are you talking about? That lotto ticket that I got? It, it's a winner. What, for like a free ticket or something? How's that going to help us? Mom, no, it's it's the big winner. A hundred million dollars. What? L let me see that. Oh my gosh! Oh! oh my gosh, is there anybody in this house that hasn't passed out? Where's dad? 
Hey, everybody, we want to, we met, we met, we won a hundred million dollars. All of our troubles are over. Dad, what exactly are you doing? It's the day we're supposed to move into our new mansion. I'm just so excited. I can't stop dancing. I can't stop dancing. Is that a new song you wrote, Dad? Yeah, I'm thinking about becoming a musician now that I don't have to have a job. I can't stop dancing. This is my signature dance move. Uh, Dad, it's just weird. Nope, nope, nope. Raise a roof, raise a roof. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, Dad. You're even weirder when you're rich. Well, I'm allowed to be weird. I have all the money in the world! Let's move these moving boxes to our new mansion. Oh boy, my dad is so crazy right now. Ah, now this is the life I was talking about. No one wanted to believe that my winning lotto ticket would actually be, well, a winner. But look where we are now. I have to agree, Molly. I thought you were insane, but this place is, well, amazing. It's off the hook. And, um, I'm really glad you bought that winning lotto ticket, Molly. Am I still grounded then, Dad? Oh, uh, that's a difficult one to answer. Go ask your mother. Come on, Daisy. Come see my new sports car. I've got one of my own, Molly. Whoa. Okay, yeah, I want to ride in yours. That's just because you can't drive, Molly, and I'm a better driver. No, you're not. I'm a fine driver. Uh, -huh, sure, says the girl who put Mom's car on the lake. Okay, that was a little bit of a mistake. You think, cheapos? Oh my gosh, Daisy. We have so much nice stuff now. Like, we've got a mansion. We've got nice cars. We have amazing clothes. We have, we have the newest iPhones. What are we gonna do with all this money that's left over? I don't know, Molly. What, what do you think we should do with it? Hmm. Daisy, I think I have the perfect idea. What are you doing, Molly? Why are you going over there by the dumpsters? I just saw something when we were driving by. Oh, I'm so hungry. I hope this dumpster food doesn't make me sick. Ew! Why are you eating from the dumpster? That's disgusting. Um, you could go to the dino. They have regular food. Daisy, he's eating from the dumpster because he doesn't have any money. Oh, wow, that's really sad because I still have like 90 million dollars and... Daisy! Probably not a good idea to tell him that you have tons of money while he's sitting here eating from the dumpster. Sorry, I guess I just get a little nervous when I don't know what to say or do. Well, I know exactly what to do. Hey, I've got something for you here. Whoa, uh, seriously? Yeah, there's like, um... Five hundred thousand dollars here. What? F five five hundred thousand dollars? Yeah, it's enough to buy you a small house. Oh, oh my God! Did he die? Ah, the homeless man died. No, I just can't move. Partially because I just got a hundred five hundred thousand dollars, and partially because I ate something rotten from the dumpster. Oh, my stomach hurts. Yeah, you don't have to eat from the dumpster. Ever, ever again. How could I ever repay you? Uh, I can't wait to go to my own house where I have a bathroom because I'm probably going to have to throw up. Oh, man, that stinks. Yeah, don't eat from a dumpster ever again. Here's $500,000. You could buy food and everything you need. Uh, there was there was this work truck I wanted to get because I'm super good at construction and I wanted to start fixing stuff up and, and, and now I can afford to start my own business. I'll never be homeless again. How could I ever thank you? What's your name? Come on, Daisy. Don't even tell him our name. Let's just do it and be good Samaritans. Molly, look at the orphanage. It really looks a bit fun town. Maybe we could donate some money to them, too. That's a great idea, Daisy. Let's do this. Hi, are you my mommy? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm just a teenager. I can't be your mommy. Oh, I really need a mommy. This place is really run down. Oh, I'm sorry, but look, my sister and I are going to um give the orphanage $2 million, and it's going to be a lot nicer for you, okay? Are you sure? Are you sure it'll be nicer? Yep, until your mommy or daddy comes to find you. Aw, uh, thanks so much. We're just going to leave the bag of cash right here. Hello, can I help you? You two are a bit young to be adopting, but I see that our little Kelly really loves you. Aw, she's super nice. Maybe I could volunteer here sometime. 
Anyway, we have something we'd like to give you. Two million dollars. Wait, what? <laughs> Very funny. Is that Monopoly money? No, it's real money. We won the lottery, but we don't need all this money, so we're giving some to you. Seriously? Yeah, please use it for the orphanage and make it a nice place for all the kids. Oh my gosh, the kids right now are out on the playground, except for little Kelly. She kind of didn't want to go out today. She just wanted to hang out inside. They're going to be so excited when they come in and they see this money. And I can tell them we're going to buy new toys and we only have one crib here for all the kids. What? That's horrible! Yeah, everybody's been sleeping on those mats on the floor over there. Every kid deserves to have their own bed. I couldn't agree more. Thank you, girls. This means the world. You're welcome. Bye, Kelly. I follow you. You could be my mommy. Sorry, Kelly, but I could come back next week and maybe I could be your big sister. I love that. Yeah, come back. Hello, this is Molly. Hello, Molly. This is the mayor of Brookhaven. I'd like for you to come down to the courthouse. Um, look, if this is about me driving my mom's car into the pool, I'm really sorry. What? You you were the one that did that? Uh, no, 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 uh, never mind, I didn't say anything. Please come over to the courthouse right away. Okay, I'll, I'll tell my sister now. Come on, Daisy, we have to go to the courthouse. For what, Molly? I don't know. I hope we're not in trouble. Me too, Molly, me too. Well, here's the mayor's office. Here goes nothing. H hello Hello, Molly. Nice to see you. Um, if you're going to give me detention, my teacher does that enough. <laughs> I'm not going to give you detention, but I am going to wait for your sister Daisy to get here, because this is for both of you. Oh, gosh. What kind of trouble are we in? I have to give my mom a heads up. What did she do now? Why are you assuming it was just me, Daisy? Because, Molly, I'm an angel and you're the demon. What? Actually, I think you're both angels. Really? Why? Well, I've been told that the two of you have been donating large sums of money to people in need. Seriously? You, you heard about that? The mail? I sure did, and I want to let you know that you guys have won Citizen of the Year of Brookhaven. We usually only pick one person, but since you both helped, we're going to pick two this year. Whoa! That's amazing! What do we get for it? You get these trophies. They're made out of solid gold. Whoa! And you get free ice cream from the ice cream shop downstairs for the entire year. Oh my god, that's amazing! I mean, we still have millions of dollars, so we could just buy ice cream, but it's the thought that counts. We don't need any rewards, Mr. W Mayo. We just wanted to do it because it was the right thing to do. Well... I can tell you that you girls are quite amazing. I'm very proud of you. Wow. Hey, uh, one thing money can't buy is um, a get out of detention free card for the year. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't have that kind of power of the teacher. Oh, man. Yeah, but look at our choices. Unless you have a win, you only can be a noob. Ooh. Well, Molly, it looks like we're ourselves. Maybe we'll just stay ourselves. Yeah, that would be good because I want to be stereotypical, beautiful Barbie. Wow. Me too, Molly. But we can't until we have at least one win. Ooh, look at you. You have fabulous Barbie hair. OMG, everyone's dressed up except for me. I'm just dressed as myself. I prefer to be astrophysicist Barbie. <laughs> Oh, man, Daisy. Oh, it's starting! Barbie's dream car going down the avenue. Oh, it's Barbie land! Of course it is, Molly. This is Barbie's story. Uh, is she even paying attention? Whoa, look at the pool! Look at the houses. This is just like the movie. Whoever made this is amazing. There's Barbie! Hi, Barbie! Hi, everyone. Welcome to Barbie's Dreamland. Oh, my God. She's flying down here. <gasps> That's amazing. Just like the movie. I am so happy to have you guys as my new neighbors. Me, too. Your Barbie land is amazing. Let's have a party tonight to introduce ourselves. Okay, but let me tell you my name first. It's Molly. Molly. Oh, my gosh. Learn the rules already. She didn't want you to introduce yourself until later at the party. Later that night. Hi, I'm Molly. 
Marty! Oh my god, my sister, she doesn't understand Bobby Land. Thanks for having us. Yeah, thanks for having us. Your pool looks amazing. I'm gonna go swim in it. This is going to be fabulous. Um, your pool is fake. I love your outfits. Let's have a best dress concert. A contest. Concert? Oh, a concert would be amazing too. Don't pick on Bobby, Marty. She just misspoke. Come on, guys. Let's get started. First up is this guy. Um, am I okay? I'm, I I didn't I don't know what to vote. I mean, he didn't look like he belonged in Barbie Land with that outfit, but she does. Oh my gosh, you look amazing. What? She just did a split. Who is this girl? Oh, here's me. I look a little bit well boring. Marty, don't say that. You're so beautiful. Oh, thanks, Daisy. Daisy said I'm beautiful, and I think that was so nice of her. Oh, there's Aww. Daisy, and she's always so beautiful, so I'm gonna give her five stars. Oh, Molly, that was so kind of you. Thank you. And the winner is Olivia. I could have told you that. She looks like she's perfect for Barbie Land. That was so much fun. I agree. Yeah, um, I didn't win, but I was glad for Olivia. What should we do next, guys? I know, we could do each other's hair. Let's bake a cake. Ooh, sorry, Daisy, you lose. I wanna, I wanna bake a cake. That's a great idea. Do you have all of the ingredients here? Actually, I already have one ready just for you guys. Wait, you baked us a cake? Are you serious? Here it is. Oh, um, gee. Oh, I need to grab all the cake slices. Molly, don't be a pig at a party. All right, it's getting late. You guys could, should get some rest now, okay? What was in your cake, though? That was so good. Ooh, lemonade. I want some of that, too. I don't want the day to be over. Yeah, today was too amazing. I couldn't agree more. Daisy, quit trying to take my seat. <sighs> Rise and shine, everybody. It's the next day. I'm ready for another beautiful day. Good morning. <laughs> go check on her. Barbie, oh my god, she fell. She fell! Wee-hoo, wee-hoo, wee-hoo! Daisy, did you really call an ambulance? No, I'm just making that sound. I don't think there are ambulances here. Yes, there are. I saw the movie. Ow, why you hit me with that bat? Rude! I'm gonna be the next one that needs the ambulance and keep doing that. Everything is fine. As always, I'm good. That's odd. Do you know why this happened, Barbie? Yeah, Barbie. No, but I know someone who might. Oh, well, let's go talk to her. She's a little weird, though. Well, then, her and I will get along great. Yeah, that's okay, as long as she helps us figure this out. All right, then, let's take a trip to see her. Sounds good to me, Barbie, but hey, when's breakfast? Let's go to say hello. Oh, this house is kind of weird. I love it. Is that a Barbie? Hey, you knocked her over. What are you doing? Hey, weird Barbie. Oh, my gosh, Barbie. It's so nice to see you. What brings you all the way up here? What? Camera drones? OMG, destroy the drones. Well, I think they gave me these bats for a reason. Oh, well, Barbie, I think you're cool. Ah! These drones are hitting me, and I don't have any Robux. Wait, did we kill all the drones already? Where did those even come from? They came from the real world. What do they want from us? I don't know, Barbie, but probably to destroy your life. You can either stay in dreamland forever or go find out. Um, uh, I'm picking dreamland. This place seems way better. Let's go see what they want. No, I didn't pick the real world. Trust me, we've been to the real world. This stinks. Perfect. It's all settled. They make you go to school all the time there. And sometimes they feed you sauerkraut on your hot dogs at lunch. It's terrible. Oh, no. Here we are. Where's all the pink? <laughs> Welcome to real life, princess. I don't think they do that here. No, they don't. That's why I told you. This is so not fabulous. Duh! Oh no, Hobo Joe. Look around for someone that might be able to help us. I found somebody. How can I help y'all? Um, maybe we can help you. Well, we aren't from here and... Listen, he just wants something to eat. Uh oh Here comes the CEO. Go to the sewer. I'll hold him off. Come on, everyone. Let's go down here. Break the ladder so they can't follow us. Boy, okay. Wow, that was a close one. Why did they say that's her? What are they talking about? I think this whole time they've been after you, Barbie. Uh-oh, Barbie. That's not good. I think you're right, but will you guys protect me, please? You will, right? Um, well, I'm not a robot, so if I die, I can't come back to life. So, um, no, not really. I mean, of course! We have your back now. Now let's find a way out of here. Maddie, do you really have Bobby's back? Of course I do. It's Barbie. 
Which way should we go? How about back to dreamland? I'm gonna pick left since I'm left-handed. Right looks good to me. No one ever picks left. You should try being left-handed. It's not a crime. Let's pick left. They found us. Exactly. Why do you think I was looking in the back? Just wanted to make sure nobody was following us. And look at they did. <laughs> Oh, boy, my life is already down a little bit. Okay, uh, maybe I should hang out over here. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. Great work fighting them off. Yeah, great work, Molly. <laughs> I'm trying my best without dying. Let's push these planks over so we can walk across. Great work, let's get across. Barbie, um, I hate to tell you this, but you kind of have a hair out of place. Wait, what? The real world is terrible! We knew you would come out of there. <laughs> uh, yeah, because you've been following us. What do you want from me? We made you. We just want to take you back. Oh, to dreamland. We are going to make so much money off of you. <laughs> Stereotypical Barbie. I think I know where they took her. Wait, they already took her? Oh, wow, I missed that. And the plot thickens. Bum, bum, bum! We have to go rescue her! If we could ever get out of this, um, pile of people. Follow this giant arrow if you don't know how to get in. We've got company! I know, Olivia. Olivia and the Phantoms. My god, she has her own band. How old are you, Olivia? <laughs> we got him. Don't tell me there's more of them. If you want your little friend back, you're gonna have to go through me. <laughs> okay, you can keep her. I can always get a new Barbie at Target or something. Molly! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, this guy is so annoying. Please don't let me die right now. I just want to see how the Barbie story ends. Uh, I'm just going to go into his office and, and smash his computer. Ding, ding. Bobby! <laughs> well, he's evil. What do you want from me? We got him! Yes, Barbie, you're free! Oh my gosh, you guys did it. Thank you so much. That was fabulous. We aren't done yet. We still need to get you out. Oh, yeah, there's a lock on the door. Oops. Let's find the key. Um, Molly, no, it's connected to the computer. You have to go in and see if you can find it. Wait, what? Investigate the computer? But I just smashed it! Molly! You always can't get us into trouble! If I only knew this, how to use this thing. Well, if you count smashing it using it, then I'm pretty good at using it. <laughs> it need some more help? Um, Hobo Joe is a computer genius. He'll be able to put this thing back together in no time. I think it's time I take this disguise off. Happy to see me? Ken! I've never been happier! Oh my gosh, it was Ken the whole time. Actually, I'd be happier if you got me out of here. Please, Ken. Right, right, Let, let's see. Which wire should we cut? The red one. Wait, no, the blue one. Oh god, I already chose the red one. Red? I agree! Did it work? Did it work? Did it work? <gasps> you guys did it! Hooray! Let's go back to dreamland. So good to be back. Oh, Daisy, we got the good ending. Dun, 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 dun. I'm that mom and mom and body. Yes, baby Kira, what is it? I, I want to eat some chocolate. No, baby Kira, it's almost dinner time. You're not allowed to have chocolate before dinner. You could have some for dessert, though. I want chocolate now. I can eat it. Uh, I, I don't care what she say. I just don't put my dad. I just don't Mmm. We the cup. Mmm. And Hershey bars. Mmm. Mm. Delicious. <laughs> la 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 la. I better get started on dinner. Who left the refrigerator open? Ugh, oh, these girls. Wait a minute. Was there a bunch of chocolate missing in there? <gasps> Baby Kira, come here, please. Uh-huh. One more, more. What is it? Did you eat chocolate when I told you not to? Who, me? Uh-oh, not me. Well, there's chocolate missing from the refrigerator, and you said you wanted some. Uh, but me? No, no, no. It was, it was my. Oh, it was, was it? Molly! Yeah, Mom? What's going on? Molly, you need to go sit in timeout. Mom, I'm way too grown up for timeout. Besides, what did I do? Molly, you ate chocolate before dinner. You know better. What? No, I didn't. I was up in my room. She knocked down a ate chocolate. I saw her. Baby Kira, you little stinking liar! Molly, that's enough. Go stand in the corner till dinner. You yeah, have ma, go stand in the corner. Baby Kira. Ugh. I've been free. 
claimed. Can't believe this. Mama, mommy, mama, 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 mama. Ah, <sighs> yes, baby Kara, what? <laughs> I just love you. Oh, I love you too. Mama, mama, mama. What is it now? I play on computer till dinner. No, baby Kira. Remember the last time you drooled on the keyboard and then we had to buy a new one? Nobody could use the computer. I'm bigger now. Baby Kira, that was three days ago. Oh, my way! No, not without supervision. You, you really, you can go watch TV or cartoons until dinner's done. Fine. Yeah. Oh, I need a vacation. I play on the computer because I'm not going to drool or get the computer broken. I, 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 big girl. Da, 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 blah, blah. I play on computer. I can't believe I'm sitting here in timeout. Well, I'm actually standing in timeout, but you know what I mean. Molly, the more you complain, the worse it's going to get. Well, I, I have to go to the bathroom. Can I go? Do you really have to go? Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm going to go upstairs really quick and go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Make it quick, Molly. You're in a punishment for something I didn't even do. What's going on with the computer? <gasps> Roblox? Molly, were you on this computer? What? Me? No, I I was in the bathroom. Sure you were. <sighs> You're the only one that's obsessed with Roblox. Well, Daisy likes Roblox and baby Kara likes Roblox. Not me. I'm just sitting here watching this chipmunk eat nuts. Oh my gosh. I didn't do it. Now you can stand there for an hour in timeout instead of a half an hour. But mom, I didn't do it! Molly, no excuses. Oh man, maybe I should have told the truth all those other times so she'd actually believe me. Now she thinks I'm guilty. Oh, la 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 la. Ooh, that smells, wait a minute. Why doesn't my dinner smell good? Ew, something smells horrible. Horrible! Yuck! What is that? Smells like a poo-poo diaper. Baby Kira! Baby Kira! Hi! Mama, hi! Hi, honey. Did you go poo-poo in your diaper? Uh, no. I didn't go poo-poo in my diaper. Well, it sure smells like a stinky diaper in here. It was Molly! She pooped in my diaper! Wait, what? I, I didn't poop in her diaper! Um, baby Kira, that's really not how it works. She did. She put in my diaper. I didn't do it. <laughs> that's the funniest thing I ever heard. <laughs> I pooped in your diaper. You're wearing it, baby Kira. <laughs> Babies say the weirdest things sometimes. <laughs> okay, Molly, that's enough laughing. <laughs> I told you she was lying about everything. And now she really got caught. <laughs> Baby Kira, have you been telling me naughty lies this entire time? Um, I, uh... Baby Kira, were you the one that ate chocolate? Uh, um, uh... Yes is the answer! Yeah, I ate the chocolate. Baby Kira, you blamed that on Molly? That is so mean. Oh, ah, uh, oopsie. Did you also play on the computer and blame it on your sister? Um, yeah. Baby Kira, and you tried to blame a poopy diaper on your sister too? Um, uh, yeah. I'm sorry to have to say this, but welcome to your first time out. What? show you exactly how to get there. I should know. I've gotten like a million timeouts over the years. All right, baby Kira, follow your sister to timeout. And Molly, I'm really sorry that I didn't believe you. That's okay, mom. I know I fibbed in the past before, so you didn't want to believe me this time, but I was telling the truth and I'm not going to fib anymore. That's really good, Molly. That's really good. Now you can take your sister to timeout. Come on, baby Kira. You do the crime. You do the time. Ah. Don't worry, baby Kira. It goes by fast. Well, not really. It's more like prison. Mom, since you blame for me for something that wasn't my fault, can I have some chocolate? 
Ugh, Molly. Come on, Mom. Come on. You owe me. You owe me. Fine, Molly. One piece, though. Sure, Mom. One piece. Mm. But who determines how big the piece is? Molly. Okay, fine. I'm just going to read this. Eat this Reese cup. Hey, baby Kira, are you okay? No, I got my first time, Mom. I'm real sad. <laughs> Mom, can I give baby Kira some chocolate? She feels really sad. Molly, no. She's in timeout. That's a punishment. Sorry, you can smell the chocolate if you want. Go back. I do what you want. Baby Kira, come here, please. I'm whoa. I got in trouble. Do you know why you got in trouble? Uh-huh. Why don't you tell me why? Because I died and played Molly and did stuff I want both to and you said no. That's very right, baby Kira. Uh, I hate giving you girls timeouts or grounding you, but you have to learn that there are consequences when you do something naughty. Now I'd like you to say you're sorry to Molly. <laughs> oh, man! Why do you eat that bean burrito? Ah! Baby Kira, privacy! Privacy! Ew, think I do do in here, yuck. Baby Kira, oh my gosh, my sister does not know anything about privacy. Mom, baby Kira came into the bathroom. She needs a timeout. What the? Oh, Molly, she doesn't understand yet. Well, she needs to learn to. Okay, baby Kira, say what you were going to say. I shall we. Aw. Baby Kira, it's okay. I forgive you. Thank my, you still love me? Baby Kira, I love you always.